levels, whatever you want. Wow. And then you can upload them, and so she like will spend time and just go play rant like tons of them are uploaded on the internet. So she'll just go on and play like other people's crazy ass Mario levels. People make oh, ones man. like that go along with a song and that are automated. It's it's nuts. So yo yo, yo 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 yo, we're live. Here we are, yo yo. Sam, why did you? Oh, say I forgot yo, to do yo, the yo, intro. Yo, yo. I forgot to do the oh, intro. Oh, you didn't do the cool intro with the. Flag all right, wait. And all I'm gonna do the cool shit. intro. I forgot to do, do the, the intro. intro. <laughs> Right, I just went out, straight to out. us. No, no. Has a better, yeah. Oh, look at this! Cool. Oh wow, we're already getting donuts and shit. Holy shit! Yeah, and you see the time there too. Yep. Because I get what? this feed in my OBS when I stream, but you know I don't get like the deluge that we get on this. Yeah. Uh, last last night, uh, I told Trevor how to get to this, oh. and he immediately was like, "Sam's Mark Ruffalo look looks. Oh wait, that's a week old." Uh, what's up, guys? Are we, are we live? Now we're live. Yeah, we're live. We're live. Now we're live. Now now we're we're live. live. Okay. We're Is live. it uh, better now? How's Darren's lighting? Every it's good. It's good. I promise. It looks really nice. Hey. Someone says I'm. Oh, that's boner hog farts making fun of me right out the gate. Right out the gate. Jesus truck. How you doing? Jesus truck. Where's your buddy pepperoni ding pepperoni uh pepperoni pizza little, like little Tony pepperino? pepperino? <laughs> Tony he pepperoni. He started watching uh, human giant sketches and he just uh, bailed on us. <laughs> he was like <laughs> Dude. Enough with that's, those dudes. That's how I lost my last girlfriend. <laughs> human giant, fucking get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Guys. Hit the road, lady! <laughs> I've been playing around. I just started learning After Effects. Yes, Sam's putting. This is the third thing I've bitch. made. Is is the spinning logo? It's so good. <laughs> I, I I, you got to make like a, a little cartoon character of Timmy, and he's like peeing, and the stream is going right into that PCP gallon. Oh. Ooh. Like it's like just constantly. Yeah. Ooh. I like I like the idea that I pee drugs. Or that drugs are pee. Mm. Pee is drugs? What about all those Facebook groups of people who drink their own piss? Do you guys ever look into that at all? There's a lot of them out there. <laughs> that spinning logo might be Can't my masterpiece. And they call it brew. I made it in 20 minutes. Dude, Sam, it's your legacy. <laughs> this is, that, I guess that's what, that's what I'm going to be known for is the spinning <laughs> logo. <laughs> Sam made a... Here lies Sam Brown. He made a spinning logo for his poop fart stream show. <laughs> did did he de design the 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 whitest kids logo? Uh, no. No, no, no. Did no, no. he, did he did... design the self suck logo? No. 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 What did he, he do? Made he spin, made it though. spin though. <laughs> <laughs> he got it spinning. Yo. Oh, uh, here's Trevor. Here's Trevor. Is Trevor in here? Uh, so right off the bat, we got uh, we got a couple sketch ide uh, ideas for sketches to watch. So I'll write them down. <laughs> oh, I thought we were gonna start writing sketches. It's, he's not even write there. Sketches? He's here, dude. He's is not. his son doing he's it? Not or, here. One, or is one of his animals in control? Did that? is Trevor invisible? <gasps> huh? He did it! He did it! You know, he's when been they trying made, for said, years. When they said that that new Invisible Man is going to be kind of like an abusive jerk, I'm like, ah, oh, that'd be so great for Trevor. Now he's doing it. <laughs> I heard his show bombed last night, yo. What? I heard his a show miss? bombed. It was a miss. Yeah. It was a miss, Trevor. Yeah. What's are up? You, what's up? You got it. You got lots of How's charges going, to answer to right off the bat. People are saying these guys, Ancient these other two guys, they're saying your show was a bomb. Was your show a bomb last night? No, not at all. Can all you guys right. hear me all right? Yeah. Yeah. No, no like, uh, no, it was yeah. great. I had, I had Hal on. Um, oh, really? Oh, cool. And, uh, and yeah, it was good. I um, I'm, I'm joking. I, I was totally messing around. I just <laughs> oh, wanted to start oh, no, some. 
Some non non. Yeah, yeah. No, like uh, no, it was a really good one. It was fun. That was great. Right. Mm -hmm. You kidding? The show never bombs. I know, but well, that's why I thought it was so weird when Darren said that. Yeah. In the, no. in the two times that it's it's been on. No, hasn't bombed yet. And uh, <laughs> Sam, Sam's well, Sam's girlfriend, two. Sam's girlfriend made him uh, st steal my raid last night. Oh, maybe Is you should like learn how to raid things. Is that like yeah. when someone steals and your? She stuff? made me steal your yeah. raid. Yeah, so I was uh, I was saying I need a raid, a fantastic uh, Trevor. Plant, how does uh, your plant. relationship work? Does Amy make you do tons of stuff? No. I, you uh, so try. so why do you think that? Why do why do you say that Emily made me steal your your raid? Because I I, I, I I know what's going on. I know the I oh. I, I, I can see yeah. So Emily made <laughs> Sam steal the raid. Oh my god. Uh, well, learn how and to run your stream. All right. Yeah. Well, Maybe you can have a spicy problem. one. Look, I'm not. It's gonna be a spicy I'm one tonight, be a spicy one. I'm not upset. I just want to say I'm not upset. Like, I know, gonna... I know. Like, the flagship, the flagship has long coattails, and you can't get mad when people want to jump on. Oh my god. Oh. Fuck. Okay, I'm gonna read Shit. some donations okay. before everybody quits. Uh, okay, so uh, two hours ago, we weren't even streaming. I was eating frozen pizza and watching Mortal Kombat. But meanwhile, A Gurnak was in here donating ten bucks. Says. I just want to say I love you guys and love your show. Can you watch a John Williams sketch? We've been asked that one a lot. Maybe we should play it. I know it's longer. Uh, Twerking do donated 10 bucks and says, Happy Saturday, boys. Think we can watch Root Beer Pope this week? Throw a little tip right. uh, into the chat. Like that, that's totally my good. job. That's my job. I'll, Root Beer I'll write Pope? It down. Oh, you're writing it down? Okay. Yeah. Uh, Blaze it like it's 9 11. <laughs> donated 10 bucks. If you guys watch Whale Taylor Homeschool, to Ooh. Mars, love you guys. Both uh, good ones, both classics. Meadows Hand says, isn't it weird the dogs eat out of bowls and people eat, a, eat out of bowls too? And then he says something about Zach dabbing his dog's wiener. I don't know about that, and I'm not going to dog pile on Zach when he's in a different No, place. but that's a true thing. Well, that's fine. You know, sometimes you got to touch your animal's junk. It's just yeah. a weird part no, of it. No, evidently, uh, uh, Zach, after his dog urinates... <laughs> and he's, he's talked about that. He talked about this right. on... Right, no, I on know he's talked about it, yeah. He uh, takes a towel... And he like wipes his dog's dick down, and uh -huh. then uh, <laughs> before it goes to bed. Wait, your your example what? of Zach wiping his dog—I know how big that dog is—and your example of Zach wiping down his dog's dick was this. Yeah, yeah, that's the size of the fucking dog, man. Sometimes if it, well, you know, sometimes... And with a towel, of, too. Like, with a towel, he's, gotta, he's like, Sometimes he's got to use two hands, two hands sometimes, <laughs> up and down two hands to get, like, No, the a, dog get itself drive. is, like, this big. Yeah. Okay. The dog in so its entirety. moving on. <laughs> yeah. It's Liam right now donated... Or no, wait, okay. Pie for Life donated 100 bucks. Thank uh, you, Pie oh. for Life. I, Whoa, I agree, thank you. I agree you. with your opinion. I stayed up all night to catch Triple S Live for the first time. Love you guys. Let's go to Mars. And then it's Liam right now donating 10 bucks. Says, happy Saturday, boys. Uh, would you consider putting Civil War on the Patreon? I don't think we can do that. And then uh, Bibbers uh, donated 25 bucks and says, can you watch Bathroom Camera? Which I think we just did recently. Yeah, like did we, we watched did that. that. Yeah. I yeah. feel like it was only a month or two ago. Was it yeah. funny? Oh, yeah. It has that. It uh, yeah, we liked it. We, we I think we ended up liking it more than we used to, didn't we? Yeah. Oh um, yeah, it ended up being kind of a hit. So yeah, and the jumbotron one, we haven't watched that one. We've oh, never okay. watched that. That's no, we've never one. watched that one. The hoi polloi just commented that dong is just dog with an n. Trevor's catching all those important, all that important. So that that makes you think. Okay, so uh, there's a poll going on. Did Trevor bomb? Uh, the choices are Trevor never bombs, and the other choice is the motherfucker stole it. Which is that choice is winning. <laughs> I don't know what that any of that means. That means Sam's girlfriend made him pull shenanigans. Made him stab no. his uh, best friend for years in the back. Spicy. I, was, dude, I, I mean, was I, first oh. of all, I wouldn't call you a friend. And secondly, uh, I don't work for you, man. <laughs> you don't what? I don't work for you. I don't, you know no. I don't funny do whatever is... you tell me to do. No, and you didn't, no. Trevor, That's what Emily's part? job. What, you, you what, what, part, of the stream, what oh, part of the stream God. did you ask me to, to raid Fantastic Plastics? When we were on the phone, you told me you didn't know how to raid something. 
And you just yeah. said, can you take care of the raid? And I said, yes. Wait, we didn't talk on the phone. I was, I was talking oh, we the did? stream. I don't think hey, so. Hey, chat, did we talk on the phone? Oh, my God. <laughs> Wait, is this what it's going to be in a, in a flagship world? Is the first half hour of Triple S is just us cleaning up the drama caused by flagship? It's, everybody talks about the flagship show. There's nothing <laughs> Everyone's about. saying no, they didn't talk on the phone. No, we did. Yeah, we, was, I called you. News. You picked up the phone. I told you to read... The that donos. was ass. And then yeah, you, you said, did. "Oh, okay." How, how Wait, do you think happen. you told me to to raid the fucking to take care of the raid? I said it over the stream. I was like, "Hey, if anybody's out there, because I, you know, there's 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 people, moderators, Discord moderators. I was like, if anyone is out there who knows how to do the raid, uh, I'd like to raid Fantastic Plastics because that's what we uh, raid every no, week." No, but you, you told me you told me do the raid, and I did the raid. Yes, you did. I'm not mad. I told you. I get oh, it. Then why'd you bring it up? Uh, oh because God. I thought it'd be entertaining to. to oh wait, and about. also, yeah, you are mad <laughs> because when it happened, we can see you. We can go back to the footage right now and see you go, motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> because oh, you that. don't know how to run a stream. <laughs> Mother. And because you were on camera for five minutes after your stream ended. I did. I was. It's called. It was a little. It was a little Easter egg for everybody. <laughs> you that was see, smart. You could see me and Hal just that. shooting the shit when the facade drops down, and it's just two guys getting real. Do you want to? Do you want to talk to Emily? No, not, <laughs> is that, no, not dude, at all. If you, want, if you have a problem, <laughs> all right. Hey, oh Emily. No, oh, no. Can God. we talk about oh, it? Emily, Trevor wants to talk to you. See, this business. is what he's doing. See, it's got it, this is. To to. Emily, Trevor wants to talk to you. It's this is good. This is very Yoko in the room during Abbey Road. Oh, this Yoko? Is, oh, is no. it? She's wearing a Yoko Ono t-shirt. <laughs> see, see. Oh my God. <laughs> what? Hi, Emily. Hi, guys. Hi, Darren. Hey, Timmy. Hey, how are you? How's it going, Emily? It's great, Trevor. What's up? <laughs> Sam is irritated because I pointed out that you wear the pants in the relationship. The, oh my god, you have no idea what our house is fucking like. Are you kidding right. me? Wait, I wish that... you guys knew the truth. Listen, I'm just I'm this is who I am. And I'm sorry if that makes other people feel emasculated. I I'm, don't have a problem. I, not me. I'm fine oh, with lip, it. Lip, I, lip. I can tell. I can tell you're not worried. <laughs> um, I'm just saying that he got upset because I was saying that you kind of, you know, run the show there. And uh, and and he got upset. I would say I... the same of Amy. I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Yeah. <laughs> like it's usually yeah. the ladies who are running most things. I agree. I mean, but, uh, I mean you know, you yes, guys been close for the last That's true. fifteen years. I don't know what to tell lady, you. Right? I mean, you know. I mean, I don't know what to tell it, you, bud. You know? Um, but yeah, I don't know. Uh, but you know, man, my, do, my lady, do like my you lady do. beats me. <laughs> yeah, I've seen it happen, <laughs> buddy. Ain't fun. Right. Oh God! This is this, all live. We're still live, right? This stream's fucked up. What is it, Darren? Darren? Um. All right. Well, I'm gonna go. <laughs> so. Oh man. Thanks Emily, for I'm having. Miss you. Oh. Well, this one. Yeah. Right. Oh. I'm gonna miss you. Okay. I like you. Hey, I'll be on Trailer Boys <laughs> tomorrow. Are you gonna be there? It's all right. It's fine if nobody else does. I'm fine about it. Okay. We all, okay. Everyone likes you, Emily. Everybody likes oh, you. Oh, no, Trevor. Oh, be well, no, no. People came after me hard in the chat. Yeah, is that people what you were want? going after me hard. Oh. I might get is messages, and it's fine. Oh, no. It's fine. Like, that's just what happens, like, when you're a woman on Twitch, and then somebody's yeah. like, fuck this woman. Everybody else is like, yeah, let's fuck this woman. So it's fine. <laughs> it's just like, it's on, it's on you, and it's all right. I I'd also point out that that is uh, that is our community, though. It's uh, are we call the congratulations. Oh. Yeah, we're we're a, we're a safe place for uh, rascals. No, yeah, wa know. wash your Yikes. hands, man. Keep washing your hands. Yikes! Sam, I mean, listen, hey, Sam. Can you? Uh, Sam, I knew this was going to be the same. Now shit. That you did. <laughs> now that Sam's done the rotating logo, Sam, can you just animate a disclaimer that we just always have rolling over Trevor's face like the whole time, like the whitest kid did not necessarily endorse anything <laughs> happening in this square. Everyone knows that. It's easy. It's easy. Oh, God. Everyone, knows. Right. Everyone knows that we don't endorse you. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> Have a great stream, you guys. I endorse you. Bye. <laughs> Bye, Bye, Emily. Thank Bye, you, Emily. Emily. I endorse Love Trevor you. a good 38 Bye. to 45 percent of the time. I just I want to make so sure <laughs> that we understand that, like a solid third, right? I don't know. Hey, you know what though? Uh, can we talk about the sketch bracket tournament? Because it's Sam. Anyone else you want to bring on? You got an uncle or a cousin back there? <laughs> oh. <laughs> did you did you dig your own hole? Did you dig your own grave here? I mean, like, I don't know. Did I? Did we not want to talk about? Did I not bring this up earlier? And you go, oh, let's save it for the stream. Yes. Yeah. Let I me mean, entertain for the heart. stream. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. Was this under, was this entertaining for you, Trevor? Yes, it was. All right. Cool. All right. Just make a chair. Just uh, make a chair. Darren, uh, do you want to like, uh, you want to just like send send each other some texts about something? We should do a breakout. Yeah, can we do a breakout Please. show? Let's yeah, see. You yeah. know, I, I have a Twitch. Yeah, I have I a Twitch out. channel. We could go do a Zucchini Boy special on here while these guys hash their shit out. You know, we can do that. You know, I just like... jump from one drama to another. We can't. Okay. Oh, we you can't leave about... them alone. You want to go to a, into more drama? Are you I gotta talk, about... talk about something. A and, sketch uh, bracket or what? And uh, this is a sad day. For the whitest kid fandom, why? Because uh, oh, yeah. you know, this is a sad day for the community. You know, we're trying to. And by the way, first, of all, I gotta say, what I'm about to do is very brave. Um, but uh, because I know how people are going to take this, people are going to come after me, mm -hmm. as they do with most whistleblowers. They're going to say that I'm. That, I'll tell you, the simple-minded among us will say that I'm being a sore loser. But I have to call shenanigans on the the last round of the voting. Uh, I believe we ha we were there was stop the count. There were bots. <laughs> and I can prove it. I, this okay. is I'm not just doing a my pillow guy thing. I can actually I've got the fucking receipts. <laughs> Sometimes I think that's due to the that's left up to the eye of the beholder, Trevor. On the well, tournament bracket, the that's tournament the bracket. Decide and, if and you're first of all, if, I, if you're being my pillow guy, I want to say I want to say uh, nothing but admiration and respect to uh, the the uh, the fan that was putting on this bracket. Uh, mm -hmm. I was excited. It has brought us a lot of uh, really great content over the mm -hmm. past uh, couple of weeks, um, mm -hmm. and I was excited to get like an official thing. But I gotta call <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> now because and i feel like we either have to re-vote or this thing goes down in the books with a giant asterisk bes behind, beside it okay well what, first of all it's asterisk and asterisk is a french viking but oh, is asterisk <laughs> is what you're talking about yes uh okay what uh, what happened was okay. horses love stegosauruses was beaten by cubicle boss Bad. okay uh Fair. it was a it was a disastrous defeat it was four thousand mm -hmm. to nine hundred mm-hmm 5,000 votes were cast yeah. in this thing. Yeah. Previous, all previous ones, they, the winnings was like 300 to 200 or 300 to 400. Like there was, there was not even a... Ten, 10 times as many votes. Okay. Ten, times, 10 times as many votes. <clears throat> now... I also say, thought that was weird. I'll say I thought that was weird. But also we've been talking happen? about it. We've been talking about it a lot. So Did know. it get well, like publicized that, well, hey, everybody's got to vote? But wait. I'm like, glad you asked, Darren. Like this, so this is the thing. Like everybody, you could say, "Hey, this is we're getting to the final four. This could be like you know, people. The interest was going up, but we only have about thirteen hundred people at at uh, at the at the height of the stream last week. So only thirteen hundred people heard about it. Now, I also well, know what you're. I also know what you're thinking. This goes on YouTube, and, and, thousands and, and thousands and thousands and thousands yeah. of people watch it there. But it didn't go on YouTube this week. It only went on YouTube seven hours ago after yeah. the vote were in. This is a case closed. This is shenanigans. I demand a recount. I contest this. This is fucking Biden all over again. Like, you know, we have to, <laughs> we have to stand for something here. Sam, how's that disclaimer animation coming? You almost done uh, it's, it's, <laughs> Yeah, yeah. It's coming along. I'm getting good at After Effects. <laughs> Well, should do should we all put our vote in uh, to have a recount? Well, okay. Well, I think we Horatio Peacock, who is the Reddit user, we don't who does this. we don't control it. We have no control. Right. But Horatio I think Peacock, if we Peacock, do you watch? Are you like do you watch this live? Are you in the chat? Can you defend yourself? You know. 
Let's see. I'll watch oh, I don't think it's that person's fault. I think somebody. No, I know, but I, no, I don't mean defend. I mean like explain. No. Maybe they can give us some Is insight. It Sutton, Sutton says, why. "Yeah, here I am." Uh, we'll see. That's the problem. Everybody. But who knows? Say yeah. <laughs> Yo, Horatio, DM me on Reddit, and uh, maybe you can help us uh, shed some light on the process here. This was a bot. People were upset that I, uh, you know, this was because uh, I was saying I, I was just laying out the case for horses love stegosauruses, and it, and it uh, it pissed off some fucking hacker, and uh, they used a bot army, a Russian mm -hmm. bot army. Oh, to, now they're uh, to sway. No, no, no. On your side, you're supposed to say I, Chinese. I was surprised to see that uh, Happier beat uh, Lincoln. Yeah, by a lot. It's all shenanigans. Okay. Malarkey. I mean, that was, that was a close race. <laughs> Someone but said I, I, they I, think I hired bots. Why would I hire bots? Why would I take down Horses Love Stegosaurus? I want to see Horses Love Stegosaurus the go is, all the way. We, we all love that sketch. I just mm -hmm. thought it, what, what I brought up last week is I thought it was being, uh, uh, the numbers would maybe be unintentionally skewed by Trevor's propping up of it, whereas I thought maybe we should not be involved in the election, in the uh in the voting process see what now, happens I when we're like not we should... but we were no, no but, but we, we were. were trevor so this is the problem so <laughs> what i'm saying is this secret bot assassin whatever happened here is a response to the fact that you've been flogging that fucking coming horse for the last few weeks you know what i mean so just so just yeah. fuck democracy fuck democracy it was a good oh, run oh no i'm Let's saying pack no. It up. That's what you're saying, A, and B, what I'm saying is we, the four of us, five of us, should not be commenting, we should not be trying to influence votes either way and let the people vote for the sketches they like without our, because we already made the shit, we already put sketches out there, we should not be trying to tell them to vote for this one or the other. That's what okay. I'm saying. It's an interesting, it's an interesting point. Hindsight's 2020. we have to deal with the problem. I hand. was saying that last week, you butthole. I've been the saying it since you started I, doing it. The problem at hand. The spicy I, night. I spicy. also I want to point something hey, out here. I want to point I, out, Derek. I did not bring the spice tonight. Trevor came in here with fucking the bomb <laughs> hot sauce all over his soul, and he uh, brought I, the spice tonight, hundred percent. Oh yeah. I, I want to point some something out here too. Okay. I've been. Yeah, I, I, I want to point fucking, something out after uh, Sam, so I can't do after Sam a, talks. I've been a, an acquaintance of Trevor's for twenty years, <laughs> and uh, an acquaintance. <laughs> He is more passionate about the the attack on the democracy of this voting system than he is on any attack to the American democracy. So this is serious stuff for him. Yes. Speaking of which, and I, I, way, cared. I said they should recount those votes. <laughs> so there's a poll going on right now that says I was in Washington. Did we storm? Oh God, Trevor! You and your buddy from Mister Show. Yeah, I was yeah, going to say yeah. you and Mister Show guy. Carpool. Wait, wasn't some other weirdo? Wasn't like uh, not Kevin? Stone, Ariel Pink, weird... huh? Ariel Pink, Pink? yeah, he was the there, band, right? Yeah, who's that? It's a guy. Okay. Anyway, I think Ariel uh, Pink so... and John Mouse were both there. There's a st there's a poll going on that says storm the WKK Capitol on June 6, and the choices are six Emperor Tyran Tyrannus and no, I have bad taste. Six Emperor Tyrannus is winning by a lot. Now this is important. Uh huh. We shouldn't say anything about this because if it happens, then we get in trouble. I learned that. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, we I, I was gonna say I was just gonna point out that Let's like, not get Matt Gates if I was seriously and honestly looking at those two sketches, like which one is a better sketch? Mm -hmm. I would definitely pick Cubicle, Cubicle Boss. Right, but this is also. I mean, about horses Tony's love stegosauruses. Is is hmm. I want it to win in the same way that I want the Cummies NFT thing to just be on television for people to talk about. Like, right. it's 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 just Cubicle Boss is a better sketch. Darren just became suspect number one. <laughs> uh, he, okay. he probably knows how to hire fucking hey, Russian I, bots. I, uh, if I am answering honestly. I don't want to like ruin anything, but I've gotten more information from the guy that made the bracket. Can I inject some actual information in this, or should we just keep going? Sure. Yeah, let's hear the facts. Do it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is sketch bracket guy, Timmy. I have no idea whether or not anyone rigged the vote. I was also surprised at how many votes it got. I will say this: 
The tournament has received more and more votes every week. It started out with a couple hundred. Last week it was over a thousand, but jumping up to five thousand is definitely suspicious. Then he says the vote numbers did go up pretty steadily throughout the week. But there was never one huge spike that I saw. Obviously, this one kind of is. But then he said, if people want me to redo the vote, I will. I could set it to one response per user, which may help curb it. Uh, frankly, That's what it always should have Hold been. on, let me finish. Frankly, some of the results were rather odd this week, and I agree. You know, he agrees with us on that one. You know, so yeah. So, Rachel, if yeah, you want to, eggs. if you want to redo it, you know, we'll go back to the Elite Eight and try it again. Yeah, we could do that. I I think so. Yeah, but- I mean. I think the fandom deserves it. Here's the thing: is like uh, uh, this is all. It it doesn't you know. Fuck it, right? You know, like whatever. Like let's just do it. <laughs> yeah. What do you like, mean? Like it's not like it's I, not I like wanna, I want to see someone's what? losing out on prize money or anything. Like right. it's not like yeah, no, it's oh good. we were redoing the Super Bowl here. Or like uh, the, it's uh, the principle. Could, yeah, yeah, but I, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. what I'm saying is, like, it's nothing to just do it again. I mean, horses love sex, so it's going to lose. It will now. You know, be- it will now. Oh, my God. All right. Be- hey, no, it will. Some- it will, because huh. everyone everyone will be mad at me. Everyone's mad at the whistleblower. It's fine. I no one's it. mad at you. But I'm not mad just, at you. I just want it to lose fairly. That's it. That's all. Right, but the fact that you were pimping it so hard was making it win possibly unfairly because you were kind of, you know, because let's say, hey, let's put out there, you are an influencer, my man. And so by you talking about it every week, more people are probably voting for it than would have if we never said anything. You know what I mean? That's yeah. Yeah. Now okay, you're looking. Yeah. Now right, you're looking for a... You're not, now, now you're looking for a, a, some some relief, you know, some government relief. You're looking for that that, you know, like you you're, you're the banks and you've failed and you've crumbled and because uh, you made these bad bets and now now you're looking for the system to to bail you out. Okay, I'm not sure uh, I follow that analogy. All right, anybody else? <laughs> I'm gonna do some donations and try and find an excuse. And then, to leave. And then okay, let's so. look at the bracket. Let's let's like actually. I don't look want to look at the bracket anymore right now uh, well what i don't even know what all won i just know those two trevor won <laughs> all right. what did the greatest win uh, okay yes. oh, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll look at it uh yeah the, the the final four is like uh actually pretty solid whitest kid sketches you know it's kind of what you would expect basically uh so we got uh where's the bracket here we go <clears throat> yeah i can uh let me screen share that shit Sam, can you uh, d- enable me, my man? Sure. Dahlwicker says, Trevor, you're getting too close to something. You better watch your back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This could go uh, all the way up. All the way up to Jim Reddit. <clears throat> okay, so uh, happier with your mouth open defeated Abe Lincoln, which is crazy to me, too. First of all, the, the crazy thing that we need to get out there is, yeah, uh, around 1,000 people voted last week, 5,000 voted this time. And like Horatio agrees with us, that is a suspiciously large jump. So, anyways, uh, we happy with your mouth open. Just plain not that popular, huh? No, I wasn't. <laughs> so we what? Are just plain not that. I said we are just plain not that popular. Oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I I didn't hear what you said at first. Okay. okay. Would, did so, you think someone sat there and like voted a thousand times? And no, it was it's like, a bot. You saying it was uh, a bot? It's a All rusty right, bot. We, can we just move on for a second and just do but something? But they, besides but they yell did at each other? an even amount. Like it's not like like it's all inflated on one side. They were they would have to be like, all right, I'm going to give like, you know, like an extra fifteen hundred to Abe Lincoln and an extra two thousand to Happy with Your Mouth Open. I'm I'm sorry, Timmy. I know you want to keep going, but I just want to answer this one. I I, I believe he addressed this to me, so I should get to respond. Uh, I believe that. <laughs> Uh, it is because you have to vote on each one for the vote to go in. You can't just pick one to vote. For. No, you no, have no. To vote yes, on the but why? Why isn't it that uh, the the grapist is winning by four thousand? Because the the like if someone filled out a simple bot kind of like like protocol thing, and you know they're like all right i'm gonna vote on grapist i'm gonna vote on happy with your mouth open i'm gonna vote on uh whatever the other two are and those would be the sketches that would get inflated votes yeah but then it would be too obvious okay they I, thought I think, of that uh, <clears throat> it, yeah it seems like uh, whatever i'm just pointing out that every... it's like yeah 
Yeah. It seems like whatever yeah. happened happened to every vote, not just the one. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. Anyway, so happy with your mouth open. Legit. A hey, Blinken. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, it could be. It's just, but it is a very crazy jump. Um, cubicle boss beat horse love stegosaurus. Happy with your mouth open beat a Blinken. So you got. So the next, if this were to continue, it would be happy with your mouth open versus cubicle boss. Over on the other side. We got uh, Grapist defeated Mountain of Chairs. Mm. Pretty close. I mean, it was within five votes. Even so, even if this is even if this five thousand vote thing is accurate, that'd be wild because that's it only beat it by five people. Uh, so yeah, then that's be crazy. And then down here, you got Hot Dog Timmy beat Opus, which you know Opus is mm. great, but you know Hot Dog Timmy's got the you know more people talk about it, you know whatever. Yeah, yeah. So anyways, it'd be Hot Dog Timmy mm. versus Grapist and Cubicle Boss versus Happier with your mouth open. But. I'll tell I bet you. it's gonna be. But after Grapist? the brackets, it'll be Horses Love Stegosaurus versus Horses Love Stegosaurus two, which we didn't even know was a sketch, but it'll be in there. <laughs> And then Horse Love Stegosaurus is three, and then Hot Dog Team. <laughs> All right. What? Uh, I, the, for, for reals here, uh, okay. now looking at the numbers, when I initially saw this, I was like, shenanigans. There's no way that, that 10 times as many people That's voted. That's what I thought, too. That's what I thought, too. But that the Grapist uh, Mountain of Chairs vote is so close. So this, So hypothetically, this person was like, I don't want horses to love stegosauruses to lose. I'm going to pump the votes there against that. But I don't care who wins in that one, so I don't care if it's that close. Because, like, if you were trying to rig everything, why would you have it that close? Because, you know, five people could come along and it could go a different way. I'm just saying if you're going to add 4,000 votes on the others, you split it more evenly. I mean, you, you're, so your 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 thought is that this is specifically a hit on um, horses love horses stegosaurus. Love stegosaurus. I, I know in the yeah. bottom of my soul it is. Okay. All right. So uh, we're we're gonna just probably redo the uh, elite eight. It's probably what we'll do. So. Uh, backup, <laughs> backup, backup, backup. Salmon says, "Jesus, move on." Yeah, I agree with them. Yeah. But um, yeah. I, I, I don't mean, think we should. I think it's I'm fine. Talking, I'm talking to the, the bracket guy. We're going to get it figured out. So uh, uh, let me read some donations. Uh, the bracket person donated 10 bucks and offered to redo it. So awesome to them. Uh, <laughs> Professor Marth donated five, says, can't make it tonight as I'm celebrating Mother's Day early with all my baby uh -huh. mamas. Love that. Uh, Ipso Fax Machine says, watch Helicopter Cheating Wife. I kind of forgot about that sketch. Oh, God. Uh, here's someone donating five bucks. Blaze it like it's 9 11. Uh, donated five bucks twice in a row. Says, thank you, Trevor, for standing up for chat's rights. And then the other, other five bucks says, we want to recount. Horses Love Stegosaurus is way better. So you're getting it, 9 11. You're getting it. And then, okay, so here's another. Uh, now, this is, this is a fake controversy that some people thought was real. But uh, somebody donated 10 bucks and says, Timmy, I'm a professional boxing trainer in the Midwest. I'd be willing to move to South Dakota for three months and offer you a free 20 hour weekly training regimen to prepare for the big fight in Reno. <laughs> You gotta do so, it, Trevor. Uh, Tre Trevor the other day uh, went on Twitter and said he challenged me to a boxing match, uh, right? A boxing match in Reno. Right? Yeah, I was just I was making a joke about the whole Logan Paul. Um, yeah, you know, there, he's gonna do a, a Mayweather on the fifth, right? Which and is it's gonna so be fantastic. I may not do se uh, self suck that night. Well, because uh, he's probably that. gonna get. I well, mean, why can't we just all watch it on the stream? Oh, we, get oh, sued. we can figure that out. That'd be we great. get sued up the butt for that, right? But I <laughs> yeah. mean, Floyd Mayweather is going to. It's going to be a three-second fight. We right? can watch it. Might, I mean, I mean, uh, uh, I, I think Jake is better than Logan, but uh, Mayweather's old. He's also yeah. the greatest. Yeah. But the only other, the bad thing about Mayweather though is that he's a boring fighter to watch because it's Wait, mostly he's mostly defensive. Okay. Did both so, the Paul brothers box? They're both boxing. Oh my oh, god. Oh, okay. Wait, I, so thought, I thought it was just this? Logan. This is no, Jake, Jake Paul or and Logan, Logan Paul. God, they're so which which one okay. is this? This one's Jake Paul? Jake fought two weekends ago. Logan oh, I thought is that was Logan. No. Okay. Well, here's the thing with Trevor saying he wants to fight me. Is, you know, so we joke back and forth on Twitter a little bit like we're going to do it. And then uh, that night on Zucchini Boys, people were like, what's your problem with Trevor? Because, like... I, w I forgot about the late Jake Logan Paul thing too, and so a lot of people thought you like wanted to actually fight me. <laughs> oh, he does. Well, he I does think we could, but a lot of them say I could beat you, and I'm not going to vote either way because I don't want to. You know, I I want them to vote the way they want to. Timmy, but Timmy, then. you cannot beat Trevor, dude. You want me to start with you, you little punk ass bitch, dude? I, I mean, I, let's just it, be real. 
I, I also think Timmy has a good chance. Uh, I think Timmy has a good chance, and I want everyone to bet on him. But I also think because I also think because it's an exhibition, we also get to bet, but we have to bet on ourselves. We can't bet. To, we can't throw the fight. But like, right. I want everyone to vote for. I want everyone to bet on Timmy. It's well, so I want to bet on Timmy just because the odds are going to be amazing. It's so weird that you and yeah. Trevor yeah. are trying to unfairly to weight something. <laughs> Well, and then someone said, like, is this going to be a knife fight? I said, no, but with Trevor, you never know. <laughs> Who was that guy, Trevor, that you we were at a party and, uh, like, I, I can't, he was, like, taunting you or something, and then he, like, hit you in the face and you just immediately you know, punched him right in the nose and just blood. <laughs> Are you guys playing in the well, face? Wasn't it playing it in might the have face? Been, yeah. uh, we know, we know. It's yeah. Jets. The Jets, yeah. 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 Well, okay. yeah. They're playing in that the face, awesome. I believe. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> hey, uh, so we can talk about this because we I think we planned it out enough, but people keep asking. And uh, Bob Christina Myers is returning very soon. We're getting it figured right. out right now. Yeah, and it's going to be. It's uh, not going to be called Bob and Myers. It's not. We're not going to call gonna be. Why not? Well, yeah. So that people, uh, Bob and Myers season two, and then you put whatever it is. It's going to be western themed. Yeah. It's going to be called so Buckerson and, and Broncos. A group named Buckerson and Myers fits right into a Western theme. You could, someone can have a medicine wagon with it. You can have like a bar called that, whatever, you know? And, like, and this we, one... we get to choose different characters though, right? Yes. Yeah, yes. you know, you, okay. we're not going to make okay. Peppermint <laughs> ride, a, ride a horse. Yeah, Although Buckerson and Myers sure. is just the name of the show. Right, I would love to okay. see Peppermint ride yeah. a horse. We'll Dude, if you there. want, I mean, you know, we're doing, for RPG nerds out there, we're doing Deadlands, which has a magic element to it. So you could have, you know, if you want to be Peppermint again, I can... Make it happen. <laughs> uh, That'd be also, hilarious if we just choose our same characters just, again. But, but Peppermint with like a but cowboy I, hat and guns? I mean, just, I'd be into it. Chat's be giving Buckerson and Broncos a lot of love. As guys. the name? As the name Buckerson and Broncos. Isn't that disrespectful to, to Myers, though? <laughs> like oh, a it, it was a named rapist. in his honor. He was oh, a yeah, horrible that's right. person. He was a horse. He was a horrible orc person. I forgot about the rape. Yeah. I really like the uh, the whore town for the, yeah. the western one. Well, you know what? Trouble in whore town. I think there should Trouble be. In whore. Well, that could be Buckerson and Myers season two. Trouble in whore town. <laughs> Nailed it. Nailed it. So that'll be yeah. That's Are what we, it should be. Yeah, I'm, I vote for that title. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. that's great right? too. Okay, yes. so Buckerson, Buckerson and Myers season two. Trouble in whore town will be starting. Uh, it'll uh, it, for the pay. It, this will be bu totally for Patreon. No, 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 no! Don't say that. No, no, that's not how that works. Okay, it's not totally for Patreon. It's still gonna go out on YouTube. Patreon subscribers get the unedited version of it. Oh, right. that's gonna be terrible. It's like we're no, penalizing no. But them. I mean, the, the only <laughs> understanding there is like if we talk about personal shit, we take it out. But they get the whole. They get the whole thing. Some people ask to see that, Darren. You'd be surprised. So, no, but Plus, they get it uh, first, right? They'll get it like they ask to see it. Then they'll watch the first 10 minutes of it. I'm sorry. And... Hold on. Uh, Trevor, what? So they get it first, though. The Patreon uh, subscribers get it for like a week early. That's the or... same question on video stuff, oh. Sam. I think so. Okay. Um, but anyways, but also the rules on Deadlands are much smoother. Plus, we all, even though you guys might not know the rules at first, it's kind of a, you know, you be more in the groove. So I don't think there will be as much as like, uh, stuff. So. Anyways, but either way, that's that's how it's going to break down. I'm really excited about it. And uh... wait, so uh, do we get to choose like our character and what our business is and all that yeah, stuff? Yeah, it'll be or, like you did it, last time, where there will be like a preloaded. Well, it, uh, it's different for me because like I just showed no, up. Well, yeah, you guys you are up. like you're yeah. a girl well, we in made a room. You, we made you be a character that was already there, but. Starting on the ground floor, what you'll get to do is you'll pick your kind of class like everybody did. There's a preloaded character, and you can pick their gender and their name and all that kind of stuff, you know. So, all right, yes. so if I Who choose my character's name as Cummy Bottoms, like I did originally. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, why not? Did Trouble not? in Horror right. Town. <laughs> did we not let you pick Am I going to get next again? <laughs> yeah. Did you get shot down on Cummy Bottoms? He did. I, yeah. Yeah. Cause I, I was like, it's the only the only female character in our thing, and her name is Cummy Bottoms. Okay. I thought we we so, like got away with the more with Peppermint Pissy than yeah, we would have with Cummy Bottoms. Solid point. 
Uh, yeah, but you know what? I would. Sounds like some eat. woke bullshit to me. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want me to um, grab Emily? <laughs> yeah. Hey, will you get Emily back in here, dude? <laughs> Remember, it's quickly becoming like a drawing of a fucking <laughs> Richard. What's that guy? Anyways, uh, what the fuck was I gonna say, Darren? I, well, I mean, you be whatever you want. However, when I hear cummy bottoms in a western, I I think of one of those old gray prospectors with like no teeth. He's like, I'm cummy bottoms. Come on, let's go check out the gold in my cave. You know, like. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's and the thing the thing about the the whore town the actual town that's got to be the problem is that there's just so many brothels that they're like the business nobody can make any money because they're just all competing there's like 18 brothels in this one town and then a bar and that's it and so like we got to go save the town Zeratonin 7 just said and the gold is jizz <laughs> Yeah. What I, I like about that, writer. what I like I about that is that writer. we've slowed down chat, so you only get to write something like once every two minutes. And like he's like, <laughs> he's like, he's like, and the gold is shit. <laughs> it's like, what is it? What is it? Genius. <laughs> okay. Yes, and the gold is jizz. I'm gonna do a couple the more heavens journals. open Can... up, lights pour on him. Yes. Kenzio donated 20 bucks, says, Happy Saturday, everyone. Would it be possible to have Huggins Family Auto added to the watch list? I'm always down to watch Huggins Family Auto, so... We've watched it, but I, I will add it to the it list for sure. It is fucking great. Um, <laughs> and then also, I think that was the great, first one we watched. It is, way before, back on the YouTube stuff, before we did Twitch. Uh, Craiger's Daddy donated $4.20, saying, If Whoretown was a real town, would there be a baked beans food truck? And if you could work the food truck, how truck could you... And how far could you go and go far to come your ass off? <laughs> you good. They got you. Did they get me? They kind of got, got me, but they ended with a joke. I don't know. Anyways, yes. Uh, well, should we watch some sketches? We got a list going here. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. oh and, and Katie No donated five bucks and says, can I get a trans rights? I'm down with trans rights. Love White as Kids. Oh, yeah. Uh, and love you yeah. guys. All right. Yeah. Also, there's we should say there's some Chinese rocket. <clears throat> That's oh, about yeah. to crash. There's about to crash into America. What? Yeah. Yeah. What? Chinese Chinese rockets about to come down, and we don't know where. Yeah. Do you remember Why? that scene what in happened? Armageddon, where the where the meteor hits a bunch of random places? That's about to happen, but it's caused by China. So, yeah. are, do we have to send Bruce Willis to China then? Dude, if it hits America, I say I think we, we go already did. off. <laughs> if it, <laughs> I think how we do already we go off. Based on what? the how number of off? like straight to DVD yeah. movies that Bruce Willis does, I think we already sent yeah. him to China. You know. Well, isn't isn't that or is that Japan where the celebrities go and make weird commercials and get made bank? Like George Clooney would do like uh, weird like tea commercials and shit in Japan, right? And make tons on, of money. On trailer boys, their rocket. Go ahead. Well, no, no, you go, you go. I was going to say, if their rocket hits us uh, in the United States of America, we should just send up all of our rockets. And we're like, yeah, we don't know where they're going to land either. Like, you know, <laughs> we should just do the same thing. Just send up a bunch of rockets willy-nilly and not, like, you know, follow through. It's like hey, a I wanna, missile. I want to address something from chat. Someone says the rocket will kill Timmy. You know, funny thought, of course, but here's the thing, man. I'm in the fucking middle of nowhere. Like, they don't know. I, I mean, the rocket. That's where rockets is, hit. Is it? Yep, Superman. Think about Superman. Where'd he land? Middle of nowhere. Kansas. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, wait, wait, wait. so you're thinking I'm, I'm about to get a bulletproof sun? Is that what you're saying? I could get a bulletproof sun tonight? No. No. Because they're from no, China. You're going to You're going to die. Krypton. Not that. Right. That's uh, throw out a sketch what was one of the sketches oh we got uh, john williams root beer pope uh whale oh, tail homeschool helicopter cheating on my wife is cheating on me helicopter sketch and then huggins family auto so any of those i'm down with did you do the chat thingy or what are we doing here I, i'll do that yeah yeah I, i'm gonna throw it in the chat in just a second speaking of uh twitch chat how's everybody doing you guys good Sit, someone says time travel please which one does that mean, Do you mean like time, time travel, travel farmer Oh, or, or, or not time traveling oh, friends. I forgot. I forgot about that. There's a one. Timmy time travel one. Oh, there is. Yeah. Timmy time travel, time travel farmer, time travel friends. Mm -hmm. You get a lot of time travel. Because it rules. Time it travel. was basically a time travel show. 
<laughs> and our, and, and, and uh, a bunch of, of five dudes who were like, we should just write sketches where we can have guns. <laughs> yeah. There's so, there's so many sketches where it's like, hey, we could have all these guns. <laughs> okay. I mean, Careful Commandos is like... Uh, the Great Noir said, since slow mode is two minutes long, I would just like to say, come in the butt. Thank you. <laughs> Well, is there a way for us to change that? Well worth it. Do we want to change that? No, it's moving good. <laughs> All right, I got to read this donation because it's mean. Uh, DFG Raheem says, uh, donate, donated 15 bucks. It says, Sam's aunt was weird. Can we bring her back? <laughs> 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 oh, oh, someone, Bust Anaz uh, donated 20 bucks. Says, could you watch the We Go Into the Moon sketch? That's a great one. Screw Ooh. up, donated $10, said, Trevor, share your crypto secrets so I can donate more. Love you all. Whoa. Oh, wait, uh, We Going to the Moon is different than Moon Bears. Yeah, dude. We Going to the Moon is me and Trevor as Buzz and Neil. Armstrong. So I, I saw a crypto on TikTok that was, uh, was, like a fucking child. was super cheap. And so I was like, oh, that, it was called Eclipse. So I was like, oh, maybe that'll be. But I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea. Dude, uh, here's a funny donation. Puddle Myron says, uh, donated $40, said, Hey, Whitest oh. Kids, my girlfriend and I love you guys. My mom is friends with Sam's mom, and she had you guys call me for my 13th birthday in 2008 because I was a fan. LOL, do you guys remember that? I vaguely recall something like that. Anybody else remember that? Sam, do you remember that? Uh, my mom makes me do all sorts of dumb shit like that. <laughs> uh, dude, she owns you. Uh, yeah. And then Do Dogi True. Dogi God donated five bucks and said, "Why was Sam's rap cut in the Hitler rap?" But you never had a rap in that. You just I, uh, I only lip sync. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The the rap came first. Dude, if Sam rapped in that, you would know it because he, he'll fucking spit. He's got right? bars. He's got uh, bars. <laughs> everyone's saying that that Eclipse coin is a scam. Also, oh, well then, so <laughs> disregard that. <laughs> yeah. What? Hold on, one thing I noticed about the trend, and uh, apparently last night someone told me you shouldn't do this, but uh, almost every time, let me see, yeah, almost every time someone's like, this, this, everyone's talking about like, oh, Saturday, Dogecoin's gonna hit a dollar, it, it drops, it drops, the, it, the day before, sell. Because it's going to drop yeah. on the day everyone expects. Dogecoin day, it always drops. And then wait till it starts to, like, wait till it drops and then buy some more. Uh, here's a counter argument to that. I would say just hold on to it and accumulate. Because uh, I think, uh, isn't Elon Musk going to, like, he's going to send one of them. Like, he's, didn't he say once in a tweet he was going to put a literal coin on the moon or something like that when they start doing those lunar things and that'll get a lot of publicity so oh by the way oh. he's on Sarah at live yeah. tonight has anyone seen the promos i tried to show him last no. night on the flagship and it didn't I work didn't, uh, I, I saw uh, I, I came across one i chose not to watch it i'm just like are they have you are they amazing i'm gonna God, find it I'll, I'll share screen it is it's it's gonna be a train wreck oh like, no trevor uh, the what? electric mayhem in chat said, I already put my entire retirement into Eclipse upon your recommendation. Oh, wow, Trevor. that was fast. It <laughs> was fast. See? Oh, this that's what Timmy was fast. talking about, that influencer shit. <laughs> oh, Dude, man. That's uh, you ruined someone else's life. Yeah. That well. one of ours. Crazy. Uh, guys, I put a link in chat for the, for the YouTube fiesta. Trevor and Darren, get on in there. Hold on, I'm going to share a screen real quick. Okay. All right. So uh, this is... Is this going to get us in trouble? No. Watch this. This is what's going to happen tonight. Right. Hold on. Oh. I got I to gotta stop. I got to share. I got to make he, sure the audio is... He's, he's, you're not supposed to wear a mask like that. God. Uh, he, well, also, it's like, come on. You're all in the studio. You're fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right. Oh, wait. Hi, I'm Elon Musk, and I'm hosting Hold SNL on. this week with musical guest Miley Cyrus. And Hold I'm on. Hold on. This. No what? Hold on. It like freaked you, you. You freaked everything out. Oh, Trevor, freaking stuff. Trevor, out. with the share. <laughs> this is you what happened last black night. Black screen. Trevor. Someone says this is the third time. <laughs> <laughs> this happened twice last night. 
Uh, oh man! They're saying Andy fucked it up again, man. The people are mad at you, Trevor. <laughs> yeah, because I because I'm a whistleblower. No, they're mad at you because you're a bad Twitch. No, programmer. they're they're. No, that's... he's great. He's great. They're, they're not yelling about your whistleblowing. They're yelling about the black screen. Uh, Jimmy, do the thing. What am I supposed to do? Someone says, hey, wait, Jimmy, let's watch a Jimmy. sketch. We'll show that in a second. I'm yeah. gonna uh, okay. watch a sketch. I may play the audio over the sketch, though. <laughs> You're such a dickhead. <laughs> All right. I think I that stop sharing. Stop sharing. <laughs> I did. Okay, you did. Oh, please wait. stop sharing. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right. Oh, are we going to watch this whole damn thing? Yeah, we're going to do it. Yeah, cool. Not it. It just doesn't sound like the tune that George Lucas needs for his new Star Wars meets Indiana Jones movie. Think John Williams. No. Sam, are you gonna ride the mute for that one part? Yeah. <laughs> Hold on a minute. No. I'll take a number four large and a two. Medium. <laughs> 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 No! It's just not right. No, that's not it. Eureka! I did it. Alice, wake up! I finally did it. The perfect wedding theme for when Short Round marries that Ewok. Remember this. Boom, 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 boom. 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 Got it? Oh. John Williams, you've done it again. Mo money, mo money, mo money, mo money. <laughs> <laughs> Look, honey, I made your favorite eggs. Honey, how did it go? How did what go? The song. What? What song? Last night I woke you up with the perfect tune for one short round marries that Ewok. Now what was the song? I barely remember anything from last night. Alice, I have been working on this thing for 85 hours. This is my magnum opus, the most important score of my entire career. Now, please try to remember. I woke you up. I remember that. And I sang you a tune. Oh, okay, no, I think I remember. Uh, it was something like... Bum, 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 ba bum, 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 bum. No! Okay, well... That sounds like something you would do. That sounds like something I would do. Oh, you could do what I do. Uh, yeah. I think I could do what you do. I would go. That is not art. That is not art. 
pom 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 and then it will crescendo to A minor. You know, I don't know if I'm going to go back to her after what she did with my bangs last time. Well, you're right, I probably will. Did you know that the Zimmers got new siding put in on their house? Uh huh. Mm hmm. And you didn't hear it from me, but I think it's. Tacky. Five minutes is up. Pencils down. <sighs> I'll call you back. Sherwin, come here. We need you to judge something. What is it? We would like you to judge whose tune is better. Your mother's or your Oscar, Emmy, Grammy, Tony winning father's. Alice, you're up first. Age before beauty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh God, Alice. Your song was so bad it literally made me vomit. <coughs> Take note of that, son. <coughs> and now, a new composition from John Williams. <coughs> That's just the THX logo. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom,
watching you, the sketch for the first time in years, that's what I thought of because Trevor, for a long, long time, anytime Trevor has a song idea, he hums it all the time until it gets recorded. Like for you know, yeah. If you if you were to ask my wife, top five oh. things you hate about your spouse, <laughs> it, it, like the constant humming would probably be in there. Like yeah. of Child Bride. Yeah, I'm sure like Child Bride was just and, like years. Don't forget that the constant songwriting contest that you make her do, too. That's also... Mm, she doesn't yeah. like that. And they named their son after a paint. Uh, after a brand yeah. of paint. <laughs> That's my favorite part of the sketch. Yeah. Sherwin. <laughs> it's so stupid. I like how... how I love that those are the kind of jokes we never let an opportunity pass by. Like, oh, yeah. we can make the name something stupid. <laughs> I like how, how I bleeped out that one part and everyone's like, Whoa, what happened? It's like, yeah, you know was, what uh, happened. The yeah, gamer, the gamer word. Yeah, yeah. the gamer word. Yeah. yeah. It was oh, a different time, every folks. Five seconds. It, it was, was a different time. Uh, you know what we should it was still talk bad about then. from that sketch? Is that it's painting. It's still bad now. Yeah. yeah. Well, no, it's bad now, but it was also bad then. <laughs> well, it was yeah. bad then, but there, there was like, you know, a thing, like, it was kind of like, when we would use it, it was because, like, that was how, you know, gamers or teenagers talk. Well, it's a that. ubiquitous on uh, Xbox. Yeah. It yeah. really was. Does that make it right? Probably no. not. <laughs> uh, you know what? Uh, let's talk about another great part of that. That was a testament to how good our set people and art was. That fucking painting of you as John Williams with E.T. and mm -hmm. Indiana Jones and stuff in it is so cool. You know? Do you have that? Trevor? Trevor? Me? Yeah. Oh, no. I have nothing. I, I kept mm -hmm. nothing from the show. I except you got that painting. Except no. Except I have um, the. Uh, I, I found a duffel bag that I didn't know that I had, and it had a lot of costumes in it. Like I've oh. got like the Bigfoot Grave Digger. I have the Whip Boy costume. I have all those things in a duffel bag. Wow. So mm. I should. Uh, we should auction those. Oh, yeah. by the way, today my mom was going through uh, through some old files or something. And she found an old call sheet from. When we did the the going to the moon sketch, oh, I have oh. all of those in my email still. Like, that was like, uh, I feel like we shot that first. In season that was two. in season two, so that would have been we yeah. shot that in two thousand and seven. Let me that's see. <laughs> yeah, that's I just a great remember one. that season two because that was when we had a lot. That of one's on the list tonight. We could watch that. Yeah, and uh, well, I mean, there's fun stuff to talk about with that one too, with the helmets. No, yeah, but, Let's uh, see. We shot Neil and Buzz that day. We uh, shot Entertainment Today, Falling Ladies, Dog Love Boobs, Shark oh, Man, day. Guillotine Days, and then uh, ended with Falling Ladies again. Wow. Mm. Mm. Can we oh, watch this Elon uh, Musk thing? Hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's Hold some on. important the... business to take care of right Wait, now. Wait, are we still doing commentary for this? Uh, for are we this, done doing uh... commentary? Because there's something no, no, I need no. to... We, we have about episode. another three minutes before it stops. Yeah. Yeah. What? We yeah. need to talk three more three minutes. minutes. No, we don't have three to talk. Minutes. It's just we got to be here. Okay. Yeah. Hey, uh, but can we... Uh, I've gotten some more information about the bracket from the bracket maker. Yeah. Ooh. Are we ready? Or should I'm we ready. talk about it in a little bit? Huh? Well, I mean, should we talk about the? Or is that the end of that? Uh, we we yeah. did enough. We did enough commentary for that. Darren said three more minutes. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, yeah. We're still going. What else can we talk about with that, that sketch? I feel like um, uh, I was in a fat suit. Yes, you yeah. had a belly. Yeah. I big... had a big fat suit on. Yeah. How many times did you have to get in the bald cap? Uh, it was a lot. So there was two sketches that season. There was um, that one, and then there was the one where Sam was blue, for oh. the uh, the was genie. It the same season. Same season. I feel so and, bad for Sam. Yeah, and uh, they were for some reason they were both shot over it's like seven days each, so like I had to get into that bald cap like seven times, uh, and it took like an hour. But like the thing that made me feel okay was I was like, well, Sam's got to get painted blue the whole fucking <laughs> like completely <laughs> painted blue every day. For yeah, so. to get out of a, a bald cap, you just rip it off. Yeah. Yeah. Timmy, you, you went mute. I, I will say I did have to. It's because I was blowing my nose. I had to do bald cap a couple times, too. And, I mean, obviously getting painted blue takes the cake. But getting a bald cap hurts. Cause they gotta, yeah, it's like, not you fun. Know, it's, like, really tight, and they got to pull that shit back. Because you know? Timmy and I have, have uh, uh, luscious manes. Yeah. 
I mean, I didn't have all this during the show. Uh, during the show, I would, we were always cut down to like here, except Trevor always got to keep his hair. But uh, I always got my hair cut before the show. You know what we should do? We should put that one on the YouTube, and then the next week we should do the George Lucas one because they're sort of similar. Like it's kind yeah. of in that George Lucasy world kind of. Uh, um, I always and thought, it's, and it's me and Sam both playing, uh, both the playing guys. the guys. Yeah, we should have done a second, a third sketch with both of you in it. I always no, I thought know. that. Like I remember, we would like talk about like future projects that we were gonna do and stuff like that. And I really wanted I one idea I kept on like bringing up was we should do a show about like a cul-de-sac where it's George Lucas, Steven Spielberg, John Williams, Hans Zimmer, where like they all live, uh, and just Harrison drinking George. adrenochrome and like kidnapping children. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just just what was that? Uh, just kidding, just kidding, just kidding. Just killing killing wasn't Jeffrey there like Epstein. somebody? Somebody we know was Trevor. Was it you? Was like talking about uh, like somebody got to go over and hang out with Steven Spielberg and George Lucas and like had dinner with him at at one of their houses and like after dinner they just went and like YouTube videos of themselves. Oh, this is I don't know. Them. I don't know this story. Yeah, no, I heard this story no not me. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. It was like just surreal because like all they did was just like get on the internet and like watch stuff about themselves. And then that is weird. Was, well, yeah. I had the Paul McCartney story. I told you, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's very similar. Yeah. Well, but who? Okay, so Trevor, was it you? Or, I thought someone told me that they were talking to one of George Lucas's kids once, and they mentioned, oh, that's, and they mentioned yeah. the Christmas special and the made-for-TV Ewok movies. Yes. Well, thing. also. So this was years ago, but I, I have a friend who knows his kids, and um, and he was talking about he was like, hey, like you know in that in that uh, Revenge of the Sith when like uh, uh, Anakin and uh, the Emperor are in that weird space opera thing, and um, he's like, uh, you know, he's he's talking about how his master taught him how to create life, and he's like, was that saying that Anakin was. Uh, created by the emperor and the kid lucas's kid was about to answer and then the sister was like hey 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 we're not supposed to talk about any of that which was fascinating so like lucas's kids know this whole lore kind of thing now it's all thrown out the window now because disney bought it and they're just like doing whatever but like <laughs> originally lucas had this whole thing like plotted out like a thousand yeah. years in the past yeah. thousand years in the future so. i like that lucas's mm. daughter's like hey idiot <laughs> like yeah the son's like, oh, whatever. We can say this. They won't tell anyone. <laughs> don't tell the secrets of Dad's story he made up. Yeah, yeah. I, I thought I heard a story. I don't know if it was from you or somebody else, but someone. I heard a story about somebody was at a party with one of George Lucas's kids, and mentioned the Star Wars Christmas special or one of the Ewoks made for TV films, and the kids were like, "What are those?" And that they asked their dad, and he was like, "Who'd you hear that from?" <laughs> What? Oh, you know what? That might have been me too because I okay. heard I heard that. Like, I remember um, you. T I feel like yeah, you maybe it was me. Bit. Some those made for TV Ewoks movies. Wow. You know. Are they good or they're just no, so they're terrible. terrible? I loved it when I was a kid. It's Wilford yeah. Brimley and yeah, a whole Wilford mess Brimley. of Ewoks. So like, oh, yeah. uh, I think Trevor, I sent. What's you he doing there? What's he doing with the Ewoks? He so crashes. He lives, he lives on the Ewok world, and he has a little, it's not an Ewok, but he has another furry cute thing that lives with him that runs really fast. And, Isn't uh, there, like, they witches in one the, of them? Yeah, and so they team up with the Ewoks and fight lizard men and a witch. <laughs> yeah, they just got added to Disney+. Plus, and, like, they go yeah. to the Ewok, the Ewok uh, jungle house. And yeah. all, and like he can't eat anything because everything that the Ewoks eat have a lot of sugar in it. <laughs> no. And at the end, he leave. He gets a spaceship fix, and he he leaves the planet. No. And goes, we'll help you live a better life. But um, <laughs> here's the deal, man. Uh, so a I life pitched... without diabetes. Can you there, imagine being just... an actor as, as as accomplished as and then people only know you for like a disease you have, and you're like you tried to raise awareness, and everyone's like, ha. It's the diabetes guy. Well, he did pronounce it weird. So yeah, he did. <laughs> yeah, diabetes. if you've got a chronic illness, learn how to fucking say it. Come on, diabetes. I uh, it's like nobody had the balls to like tell him on set. Like, uh, you can't correct him. Yeah, That's Wilford uh, Brimley. Brimley. He yeah. was in Hard Target. You don't just tell someone from Hard Target. He was talk. in the Ewok movie. 
Yeah, the one they made for television. Remember in the thing where he's in that, that shed all by himself? That was great. Listen, like the, the, the director the- from that commercial was like, he was like a new young director. And he's like, that was really good. That was really good. So for this next take, um, let's just try something a little bit different. And you say diabetes. You try that. Yeah. Well, and, and everybody just, was like, whoa. What you, no. He does the Niro thing. Like, no, just, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We just I know one. No, I'm sorry. I know what I'm doing. I'm not, I'm not doing selling a car cars. Here. <laughs> well, yeah. for, just, for, just for one take. Just I'll for sh- just independently do that same thing. <laughs> Just yeah. for shits and giggles, Wilford, why don't we do one take where you say the disease right? Is that, uh, is, is that? <laughs> That's how you get punched in the mouth by an 85-year-old man. <laughs> With diabetes. <laughs> I, uh, when I lived in Portland, I was friends with some people from Dark Horse Comics, and they still had the Star Wars license back then. So I pitched a, to write a comic book story that was all about all the ashamed parts of Star Wars. So it was going to be t- take place on Endor. Wilford Brimley's character was in it. I was going to have battle droids and stuff. And like it was like crazy. And they read it. And the main Star Wars story dude was like, Star Wars isn't supposed to be funny. I was like, what Star Wars movies are you watching? <laughs> Whatever. Well, there's very little yeah. humor in Star Wars movies. Yeah, but, but the humor that is is normally great. you know. And so I was like... But I also wanted to, like, take the piss out of all those parts that people, like, make fun of. You know, battle droids and Ewoks and the kids and, you know, that kind of stuff. They just weren't ready for you, Timmy. Well, they probably Is C-3PO, aren't. is he, like, the biggest uh, comedy character? Oh, yeah. Star Wars? No, Jar Jar. He's hilarious. What about Jar Jar? Man, Jar Jar's the funniest. Oh, yeah. yeah. He, he destroyed. Because he's you so racist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's not racist. Or no, it was, the, it was that... <laughs> It was the uh, underwater Gungan guy. He says not racist. <laughs> <laughs> he said not racist. Yeah, there's an episode of Clone Wars that's Jar Jar and C-3PO like are the stars of the episode and they have like an adventure together. And it's actually kind of good, but I don't Hey, can I show this Elon Musk video? Yeah, yeah, and, uh, yeah, yeah. No one tells I, that. I think Town's super mad at it. Also, right we got to talk about this Reddit thing or the uh, the bracket thing because you should go into the up. the YouTube thing. That's the the link, and then put it in there. There you go, buddy. Do that, Trevor. It'll sure firework. The the, the thing, thing that I at. put in chat. Oh, that I we showed the it. sketch. You should click. You still have to do share sound. All right. Well, hold on. First, let's. Uh, I I don't want to uh, interrupt Timmy. Timmy, what what's happening with the bracket? Okay, so uh, we're actually going to do this through Dono, so i got to read some Donos, and we're gonna, that's going to lead into it anyway. So uh, Wilford Brimley donated $10 and says, Trevor, first off, I'm not dead, which is not true. That was a ruse so big diabetes couldn't get to me. Second, help me, the Ewoks eat people. They think people with diabetes are delicious. Oh, that's true. By the way, I heard this. Um, uh, what, what, what? So there's a theory uh, that the Ewoks eat people. Right, um, yeah. And this makes sense because... When they find Leia, they put her in a woman's dress. Where right. did they get that dress? There's also a clue. They fucking ate a woman. Right. Also, and, there's and also then, a clue that they try to roast everybody right after that. Yeah. Yeah, and they, you see them trying oh. to roast. So <laughs> yeah. basically, Leia's wearing a dress of oh, someone, yeah. of some young woman that they burnt and ate. Right. Uh, and they just didn't with her because she, Carrie Fisher's like I got coke or whatever and they're like all right like you know and then they like yeah. let her live I've got yeah. Reese's w- Wicket Wicket gave her that dress not mentioning like I shat out the person's face that used to wear that dress yeah I had to pass this woman's femur it was <laughs> they tell legends of it it was really like okay let me let me and do they some did her hair for her uh, screw up. Yeah, yeah. They, they were oh, like, yeah, your yeah. hair's gross. Could you do something? We're having a dinner party. Yeah, and like, they gave her a beautiful weave. Very yeah. good. Uh, oh, they made her hot. They were like, could you, could you, uh, could you pull it together a little bit? Like, they, they were like, I, we, we do have a gold bikini. She's like, no, the last guy that made me wear one of those. You know, yeah. so. I, I know we're a forest moon, but we still have standards here. <laughs> Look, I know we all only wear hoods and have our bare dicks hanging out, yeah. but can you just fucking cover yourself up? Yes. Okay, here we go. Um, uh, screw up donated ten bucks. Said the race war trailer was awesome. Keep them flexing them editing skills. Uh, Doge God, or how do you say that? Doge God donated five bucks. How much to have Trevor shave his head on stream? And then here do we go to the brackets. So the bracket guy wrote back, donated another ten bucks. Says, hey, now I want everyone to calm down, Sam. Maybe you start managing mic levels here. They say, hey, I looked further into the votes. And Trevor 
was 100% correct that it was rigged. They even okay. made sure, let me finish, let me finish. They even made sure to balance out their other votes so I, it wouldn't look suspicious. He was right that this was a Ooh. hit against horses like Stegosaurus. I put more info in the new Reddit post, and I have that up, so I'll read you guys what he says there. I so, never miss. I never miss. Yeah. So he says, at first I thought he was joking, but I scrolled through the individual responses and was shocked by what I saw. HLS, we'll call it, horse like thing source, had taken an early commanding lead in the vote, but on the afternoon of May 5th, someone submitted hundreds of votes in very quick succession with a very specific pattern. The votes for the first three matchups were alternating every other vote, but each and every one of them voted for Cubicle Boss. You can see what I mean here. Therefore, this is all his writing, not only do I believe Trevor was correct that someone used bots, but I believe that he was even correct that they made sure to not vote for the same sketches in the other matchups to throw the scent off the trail. Therefore, we're doing it again, so here, vote again. So he put up a, a form. You can go to the Reddit, uh, the WKUK Reddit, and look for that post. It's called Sketch Bracket Elite Eight. Yeah, we're doing it again. And there's a link there to Trevor. Revote. Dude. So, Trevor, do you, how do you feel, man? I feel, you know what? I feel like Edward fucking Snowden. That's what I feel like. <laughs> I feel like I, 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 I stood up. I knew it wasn't going to be a popular position. I knew you guys were going to jump down my throat, but I stood up for democracy. And I'm pleasantly surprised that you guys had my back, actually. Well, but Here? dude, besides, okay, Sam, you guys got yelling at each other a little bit. I was with you. I was just saying that I think it, what happened before about weighing every, asking everybody to vote for one sketch, that part I didn't like. I totally agree with you that it seems suspicious for this. I, just yeah, to, yeah. So I can have my own defense there. I think it's fascinating that we, that we caught all those, like, the fail saves. That, that all the measures that they took, we were kind of like, we, we, we picked up on. Yeah. Look, you can't pull one over on us, all right? Yeah. Like maybe invincible. this is the fucking whitest kids. Like <laughs> I, maybe maybe this bullshit would work with uh, SNL, but right. not fucking here. And that's a segue to it's my a, Elon it's Musk. A, it was a little crazy. Oh, it was like so started. lopsided. Like all the other sketches, it was like really close. Yeah. And this one was just that's silly. Well, yeah. If you looked at all the thousands of votes, right? Uh, five, so each matchup had five thousand votes in it. And I felt of Stegosaurus it. was the only one that didn't get at least a thousand, so it's like that was weird, you know. Yeah, I was Something's duped. Rotten. Something was rotten in Denmark, and we and put you a stop to it. Out, man. Uh, let me just do these other two donos, and then you move on. Just since they just showed up, uh, man, McDonough music donated fifteen bucks. Says Timmy, dice making is my weird hobby. I'm making you a dice set. What colors do you want? Cool, I'll hit you up about that. Wilford Brimley Estate donated ten bucks. Thank you, Timmy, for pointing out that Wilford Brimley is dead and not in hiding on Endor. <laughs> All right, Trevor, let her rip, baby. All right, so what do I do? <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, you know, you, you go to Fiesta. Okay, I see it. No, no, like in, in the chat, there's a, a link, and you can just sign in. All right. He's and signed in, isn't he? Oh, once you not. sign in, you can put... Big, All right, yeah, vid Dick Trevor. You didn't even type it in right, you fucking dad. <laughs> <laughs> It says Bid Dick Trevor in there. Oh, yeah, it's, back to dad, the the internet. All right, now what do I do? And I'm a wild card. So you do it. No telling what I might do. All right. Same here. Rules, no thanks. Let's also the Mother's Day show. Is so it you playing? Your are going to be here. Yeah. Forget what I said. Fine, we'll be good ish. Hi, I'm Elon Musk, and I'm hosting SNL uh. this week with musical guest Miley Cyrus. What's new with you, Elon? I just did a successful rocket launch this week. Hmm. <laughs> and I did my laundry. Congrats. <laughs> Actually, no, I didn't. <laughs> I mean, I mean, how, <laughs> you know, like in high school, <laughs> when you had to, in high school, you had to do a video presentation or something, and you got to get your one friend who like really, just really is uncomfortable, and like just spits out of their lines really fast. Like that's what that felt like, right? Yeah. Like yeah. someone who doesn't want to be in front of people. Uh, Sean O'Connor, uh, yeah. like tweeted that. And he was like, just, and it's, it's the funniest thing. Like, I actually think I'm actually going to watch Saturday Night Live tonight. Cause yeah. like, I got to see that. Like, you know, I haven't watched like, Saturday Night Live since we lived together. And I, don't I was like, Trevor's either, can make me watch it. I was like, you're, you're either going to say you're actually going to watch Saturday Night Live or you're actually going to sell your Tesla. That's like what my <laughs> prediction was from that. <laughs> no, but it's like, it like that, like you need to be somewhat, you need to sound somewhat natural for comedic timing. You know, you can't just be like, hit, 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 and he's like, and like all his mannerisms are like, this yeah. is gonna be, it's gonna be incredible. I yeah, it's gonna wonder, be the room. Like, I, I will say, like, I think he's gonna slay. <laughs> That'd be Hi, doggy. If he just fucking kicks ass. I wanna see the monologue. I do wanna see the monologue, because I bet it's fascinating. 
you know? This is going to oh, yeah. be the room meets SNL. That's a great yeah. point. Yeah, that that's what it is. I mm. think you're right, man. You know, that's what they should uh, do. They should make him be Tommy Wiseau. And <laughs> just, <laughs> like, that would be funny. Yeah. And maybe oh, man, that, that would be a would great be host. Tommy Wiseau, what, host SNL. How so, rad would that so be? So why am I playing this Tommy Wiseau character? Why did you pick me to play? Because you're bizarre. You're not like a real bizarre. human. And your voice sounds weird. And you have money for some reason we don't understand. And you're bad at acting. <laughs> <laughs> uh, see, wasn't that worth oh it? Oh, my God. Oh, it was absolutely yeah, worth it. Yeah, it was. Yeah, totally. Hey, so we, should we do some fan art or should we watch another sketch? Let's watch another sketch. Let's, should we do a... What do y'all want to do? We got Root Beer Pope, Whale Tail, Homeschool is one I haven't seen forever, Helicopter Wife Cheating on Me, and Huggins Family Auto. I feel like I Root think... Beer Pope keeps coming up. Oh, I'd so like to watch, watch that, one. that one. Let's do it. I, I'm going to hit the bathroom while y'all get it ready. I'll be right back. Is that what you were going to say? What? Cheat dog? Uh, no, I was going to say, I actually, um, I've always been a fan of uh, Mr. Williams' performance in um, Homeschool. Uh, yeah. But but uh, but yeah, I'm down with both. Pub. We got time. We we can do both. Oh yeah yeah. yeah. I on. like it when people say nice stuff about me. We can do both. Okay. He's also in Root Beer Pope, isn't he? Mm -hmm. He is. Yes. Mm -hmm. Don't care for his performance in that one. <laughs> that from close to my speaker. <laughs> Tim is great. Hey, what's the alien one that he did? Uh, the alien hands. Remember? The alien when, hands? Yeah, he comes back and he's like, he pretends he's an alien on the spaceship with Zach. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, yeah. The, the, um, the space I don't vampire think we named one? That one. We didn't name that sketch. I want to suck <laughs> your that blood. Was, that was sketch number 471. I want to suck your blood. Yeah, space pranks? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that was yeah. the one with the, with the Obama uh, mug. Oh, someone says astronaut oh, yeah. prank. I think that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think it was called astronaut prank. What does the Obama mug say? Don't mess with Obama. I don't, I don't uh, Obama, and it was uh, oh, oh, which yeah. ended up being true uh, because uh, no, uh, I think nobody bombed more people than Obama. Like you know, he was drone striking everybody. That was his thing. Oh yeah, he lit shit up. He loved drones. No. Just watch that show, uh, Leftovers. That was a good show. First season, it's an okay show. Second and third season, that's a good show. See, I was wanting to uh, check that out because uh, <laughs> I've never seen it. The Watchmen. I bet show you'd like so it. Good. I yeah. bet you'd like it. <laughs> I don't even know what it is. Is it? It's about sandwiches. Uh, yeah, it's about sandwiches. <laughs> it's a good it's a, show. It's about dinner, like, but like the next day. Have you guys seen? Ah. Have you guys seen sandwiches on HBO? <laughs> it's a fucking that, good show. It's that it's show where show. the sandwiches talk. Dude, I heard ne next week, week. Next week they're, they're gonna pastrami? do pastrami. <laughs> next week there's provolone. I don't know exactly what the sandwich is, but it's got provolone. Ooh. You all I heard they're making the movie oatmeal. They're finally making it. <laughs> I like. Last week they had the girl from Girls on sandwiches. <laughs> what? Fucking good. Yeah. And then next week they're gonna put the sandwich Ooh, from sandwiches yeah. on girls. She can eat a fucking sandwich. She's, she's good. She's good. Good show. It's a good show. You know who can't eat oatmeal is Elon Musk. Did you see yeah, the season? They gave him the lead role. Did you see Insane. the season pr premiere of Sandwiches? They brought Tuna back. Yeah. What? Dude, oh. I haven't watched yeah. it yet. Tuna, tuna oh, came back. Spoilers. Here we go again. <laughs> Are we watching something? Well, Your Holiness, this is the last stop on the tour. These quarters are yours as the new Pope. And uh, you can take down any of these posters and replace them with whatever you want. Thank you, Chaplain.
Greetings, new pope. I am the old pope, but you probably know that already. Now, if, if you're watching this, I'm probably totally dead, which sucks. But I, I'm sure they made a big deal out of it because I was the pope. Oh, by the way, congratulations on being the new me. Okay, so here's a few things you're going to need to know if you're going to be the pope, which you are. Okay, you number one, God is real. He's a giant alien with three eyes that lives in the center of the earth. Now, angels, okay, angels are like super, super fragile. And if one gets hit by a plane or something, God gets like totally pissed. And every time an angel dies, God kills a million people. So watch out. Oh, the remote. Okay, so you got to hit TV, and then you hit the power button to turn it on, and then you hit cable to change through the channels, okay? And then if you want to watch a DVD or something, you hit aux. Oh, by the way, as Pope, you get a lifetime supply of root beer. But a lifetime supply of root beer is not the same thing as an unlimited supply of root beer. Supposedly, a lifetime supply of root beer is two root beers a day. What? How is that a lifetime supply? Who decided that? And here's the really messed up thing, man. A month has 30 days, right? And you get two free root beers a day. So, in a given month, if you only drink 55 root beers, the other five root beers don't carry over to the next month. They're just gone. What are they afraid I'm gonna do? Do they think I'm gonna, like, drink a thousand root beers a day? I mean, I couldn't even do that if I tried. Probably. I mean, hello? Jeez, man, okay, here's my day, right? I have a root beer when I wake up, I have a root beer for breakfast, then after that, I have to go upstairs and use the machine. Do you know how embarrassing that is? They have tour groups up there. Then I have to go up and down the line of visitors being like, bless you, my son, yada, 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 may I please have a nickel? I mean, I look like a real jerk, man. And they bring in a case of the generic stuff, and I'm like, that's not what I drink. Um, I think that about wraps it up, man. I've covered everything. So, uh, have fun being Pope, have a long and fruitful papacy, and I'll see you in the afterlife, okay? Don't touch my posters, by the way. Thanks. Later. Root beer, your holiness. Pope. Root beer? Pope. I like it first of all. He's like, first of all, aliens are real. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and angels? Angels are real? That was fun. That's a yeah. good one. That's a fun one. I, I, I remember that being a, a hard... Because we taped me doing that, even though I guess we could have cut. We taped me doing that all in one go, if I remember right. And so I had to like do that whole fucking thing. Do you remember that, Trevor? I feel like we had to do that in one thing. I don't know why that would be, but yeah, I do remember that. Just like, generally I, a Timmy torture kind of thing, I think. Maybe. I also remember we shot like my part in like a bus state. It was like it was like one of the, the Port Authority kind of things. Yeah, yeah. Or wasn't That's it like the, City Hall or something? That, that yeah. huge room we had to find it, it like was in Brooklyn, like in Borough Hall, one of those places. Yeah. Right? Oh, it was, it was like, like one like of the a, courthouse mm -hmm. places. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's weird. Uh, There's a bunch of buildings like that down around there, and I'm like, some of them I'm, we're in, and I'm like, do these get used besides for shit like this? You know? I think it's just like low budget filming, fart, <laughs> you know, low budget fart show. Because right? like so, some of our like some of our early stuff, like before we had a show, like looked the sets were fantastic yeah. because we would just talk to the city. Like I remember we did a courtroom sketch. We we're like, can we use a courtroom? And they were like, sure. And like we just went in and shot in it. Like you know they, they yeah. You know, what was that? Yeah. I don't I don't remember, but I remember we shot in a courtroom. It was in Brooklyn, I yeah. think. Didn't we also in shoot uh, shoot in the the Manhattan one, the 100 Center Street or whatever that is? Oh yeah, we, yeah, we, we shot, shot that. Yeah, that was with all those stairs. Because but that was we shot uh, Genie. Yeah, and that's like he runs up the stairs. That's like the big, like New York courthouse. Like that's in like yeah. Law and Order and stuff. Yeah. yeah. That's like the South District of Manhattan or New York. Like that's yeah. their big, big one. Let's see Sarah that's live do that. <laughs> I think I, they uh, And yeah, I saw some people yeah. in chat say this, and I don't <laughs> no, remember. They'll just build one. 
<laughs> yeah. I don't remember if it was the direction or if I just did this or what, but uh, I do have a definite Fe Ted Theodore Logan thing yeah. happening in this sketch. Yeah, <laughs> Chad pointed remember. out right before that. I was like, this is so like right. Bill and Ted. Like, yeah. Hey, yeah. what's up, dead usses? Or like, you know, like that you kind know, of. It's like it's like when he possesses his dad in Bogus Journey. I think like that was what I was doing. I also My like it's, it's and his excellent like friend it. Bill. I yeah. think that sketch is an excellent use of Timmy's Midwestern accent too, because rut rut beer. Oh, is it my saying rut beer? Yeah. yeah, you're saying rut beer through a lot of it, like rut beer. But that's not even how they say it here. I mean, we say root beer, you know, so I don't know. Well, in uh, that sketch, you're saying root beer. R root beer. You know what? It's because uh, living in New York, well, no, not living in New York, being your guys' friends uh, messed up my accent so much because when I moved there, big, sag, jig, or, you know, uh, everybody gave me so much shit for that that I overcompensated the entire way that I talked. And right. I'm like, I'm not blaming it on you guys. I just, that's just what I did because that's how I respond to things. Is, uh, you can blame harsh. us. It's fine. Yeah. No, I don't. I just kind of, that's just, not I don't really, I, I blame myself for, <laughs> you know, overcompensating by like actually changing the way that I talk. But root is weird. And we say root here. I mean, we do. So I don't know where, I don't know what the fuck that was. We say rough though. A lot of people say I rough. I never even here. noticed it. I, I didn't even either until Trevor mentioned it. We say rough yeah. here, but not we, we say root beer as far as I know, but we say rough, which I don't like. When, when you see a hot girl, you guys go rough. <laughs> <laughs> no, they don't see hot girls. Trevor got that one. Uh, and if we do, they're married as shit, so you don't say anything. Um, <laughs> and the other thing, uh, a lot of people out here, and I don't like this one. And I don't get it. Uh, like unbelievable or umbrella. It's umbrella, and that's unbelievable. Hmm. That's horrible, right? I like. I. It makes me mad when I hear that. Someone says Trevor needs hearing aids, but compensates through gaslighting. That's absolutely true. That's my big uh, secret. You get it. That's my big trick. <laughs> Wait. So uh, they're hey, saying you some... gaslight to compensate? Oh yeah. Oh, that's why that you is... do it. <laughs> Yeah, I, I have no idea what's going on. That's so what I just, gaslighters do. I'm just like, I have no idea what's going on. I'm just going to double down on confidence. That's it. That's it. Excuse me. Um, you know right, what? Let's do let some do fan a, art. Yeah, let's do fan art, baby. Or donos. Whatever you want to do. Well, baby. let me do some donos while I bring up fan art. We can multitask here. But I like everything Darren's saying. Okay, Mark David Chapman says, uh, donated 10 bucks and says, Watch Oh, he's famous. All sketch. Yeah. Uh, Wilford, there's a whole Wilford Brimley thing happening with donuts. Now Wilford Brimley donated ten dollars. Said, "Listen, I'm alive. I'm in hiding. I'm stuck on a jungle world. I was in absence of malice." Okay. Principal Rose donated ten bucks and says, "Thank you for stopping the steal, Trevor." So, um, which you know I appreciate that too. Good job, buddy. Um, Thank you. Okay, so let's get. Uh, there's not a ton of fan art, but there. One of the things is a video that is pretty fucking funny. So <laughs> we'll watch some of that. Um, we'll get to the regular fan art first. Uh, I love how cool. in chat they're like, this is a really great sketch commentary. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Every <laughs> once in a while it pops in my head that, like, like, who the fuck programmed all those bots to fucking rig this sketch contest? I know, right? It's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> well, there was, some, there was somebody last week who was uh, in the chat who was going like, who was very upset that I was supposedly putting my thumb on the scale. Really? Yeah, yeah. And I, I remember reading some of their comments and that would be my first suspect. Yes, okay. Yeah. Do you remember their name, Trevor? I do not. Okay, Okay. here we go, guys. Here's some fan art. Uh, now, there's not a ton of art, but we'll do these and then a video. And I have a, actually, I have a live piece of fan art in my house that somebody sent me that I'll show too. Okay, so uh, Future Union Tour made a logo for what they say is a movie that'll never happen, but who knows? Uh, yeah. So here's their poster for Fight Barn. You know, if Mars is successful, mm. I would I would love to do Fight Barn. We could, yeah. yeah. Did we ever crack and it? I mean, Wasn't there a problem that we did? did what really what is out? Fight Barn? I don't remember this one. We started writing it. It was basically a redneck Mortal Kombat, wasn't it? Yeah. It was Mortal Kombat oh, happened. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's a fantastic scene in it where Sam and I. Um, <laughs> Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, I the kind of police station scene. We yeah, we walk into a police station and everyone's been murdered and we're like they're pl we think they're playing dead. So, we're like we're like trying to get them to wake up and they won't wake up and we still think they're playing dead. So, we're like, "All right, we're going to take your pants off." Like that. And then we take their <laughs> pants off. They're like, "All right, we're going to put your dicks in our mouths." Like that. Oh, and goodness. then it's like 
And then it's a hard cut to us leaving the police station looking like, you know, like basically we just sucked all these dead dudes' dicks for like hours. And then we realized that they were really dead. Like, you know, it's, I love that scene. Yeah. That is awesome. Funny. Good job, Future Union. So then we got a bunch of shirts from Suvlaki and Gritz. So he made a Horses Love Stegosaurus shirt. Oh, uh, yes. This let's shit's get, great. Let, let's go. And there's I the back. One. Get me by the way, bucket, by Chester. The way, by the way, I, screen is I blank. Screen is blank. We're not seeing oh, any of this stuff. Whoops. Sam? Uh, it's the oh, share thing. Back? Hold on. Yeah, let's go back. Sorry. I don't, this I is like the podcast. The People are shirt. calling it. I don't know about the... the we got to go back. Me. No, hey, don't yell at me. That wasn't my fault. I'm doing Sorry, that was my do. fault. Something happened on Sam's end. It's okay. All right. Uh, are we sometimes back Sometimes the share just screws with things. Yeah, it sucks. I gotta go, I gotta remember to go to full screen when we do shares. Apparently, Elon's uh, uh, monologue's going no. right now, right? Yeah. And it's killing. It, so are, can they see heard. it now? It, it, they think he's yeah yeah no everyone can see it sorry. All right, so uh, well we'll go back. Here's the uh, logo for Fife Barn, everybody. So there's that. It's very cool. Here is uh, so the locking grits made a horse of the Stegosaurus shirt. So there's the front. And there's the back. By the way, I am going. To, I'm going to make a horses love stegosaurus shirt this week, and uh -huh. have it uh, available in the store by next week. Because I, I yes. now think it's a rallying cry. It's it's sure. it's it's become more than a sketch now. It's now become a rallying cry for freedom and democracy. And like it's a statement. It's a political statement to have a shirt. Is just basically you know it's saying like we're not gonna let. These Russians walk all over us. We're, hold on, hold on, wait a second. Can you hear that? I can hear Trevor patting himself on the back from here. Can you guys hear that? <laughs> yeah. What did it say? A little bit. Wait. I think the sketch, Do it's you... like a shining beacon that defines who we are it is. as people. It wait, is. Trevor, you know? well, okay, Trevor ahead, you think we're on Putin's radar? Do you think that that's who did it? Oh, I know we are. <laughs> We He's, used to talk about Trevor playing Putin in a sketch because, like, he had like a Putin impression he would do. Did I? Putin, yeah. Sorry. Hello, my name's Vladimir Putin. No, no, you did this whole thing where he was like mad. Like, it wasn't a, there wasn't talking, which is probably good given that that's what you do. But uh, it was just like you, like, you had this like look you would do, like you were Putin, like getting pissed at somebody. I can't remember. It was funny. Oh, it was like he got the wrong order at a fast food place. Something like something that. Something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Anyways, great idea. So, they should give it to Elon Musk. Okay, so, uh, and then uh, Suvlaki also put this on a t shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it's always uh, so funny. Uh, uh, <laughs> mm. <laughs> it was a bat. It was a bat. It was a bat. Okay, so, so there is one fine. more thing to do here uh, for fan art. So let me, uh, I'm going to have to share sound. And, uh, let's see here. Oh. Where's my YouTube? Okay, so um, and let me get their name first. Shit, hold on, because I um, Travis Taylor made this, and so this is a a song for Zach. It's a video, and a song for Zach called "We oh, Miss You, Zach." That's nice. So, yep, here we go. Travis Taylor himself. Oh, is that who this is? Yeah, Travis Taylor. And yeah. it's not playing. I know that's not playing. Hold on, here we go. Okay, sorry everybody. There we go. It's long. We're not gonna watch the whole thing. But... <laughs> what? Wow. Keep oh, going. Yeah. Keep going. Oh, you Who want me was to keep that? Going? Was that okay. like Fat Mike or someone? I don't it's know. It's getting better and better. That was a <laughs> sugar. <laughs> he loves video games. Oh, that's yeah, yeah. Oh. I don't approve of the fisheye lens thing on his face doing that. I don't know, that's scary. It's only half over. It's great. 
All right, that's enough. Yeah, I don't, okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> oh, man. oh, it's the lead singer of the cool. Deftones. That's who it was. It was the lead singer of the Deftones. Uh, is that it? He loves Deftones. Is he a big Deftones dude? He's a big no, Deftones he fan. Him. <laughs> He's way into the Deftones. Oh, shit, you guys. Sorry, there's one more piece of fan art. Um, so hold on and hang on has sent me stuff before like uh, you know if, stuff what go ahead if, if we do this long enough like we'll like uh, someone will die yeah you know mm -hmm. and then like uh, and then like I, I think we'd be horrible at, um, at at having to be serious for that yeah you know can you imagine yeah. doing like a uh, like you know uh, like we'd still be like you'd have to rag on everybody Oh yeah, yeah! You like, fucking idiot! If we had you to died. speak at, at one of their uh, funerals, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, some, did, of, my, some of us I worse did than an others. Obit, or I, I did the eulogy for my grandma, and it was funny. So you know, like I was a jackass then, so I can't imagine doing it for you guys, you right? Know? Yeah, because I wrote jokes for that. To... Like this would be like I'd probably fucking <laughs> do Timmy dance, you know? It's like. <laughs> hmm. And we all know that to I'm going to have to do this for the other four of you because I'm going to live to like 102. So yeah, because your people live to be oh, forever. Yeah. Like, we just you live know. forever. We can do whatever yeah. we want. You just fucking live to 100. It doesn't matter. It's crazy. <laughs> if you had to put money down on, on which one of us is going to go first. Trevor. Yeah, Ooh, probably me. <laughs> probably me. Trevor. Yeah. yeah. Darren, I feel like you're a healthy dude, but you're the wild card. Maybe I don't know, man. Maybe you just uh, maybe something happens. I don't know. But I feel like Trevor. Mm-hmm. I just got my cholesterol checked and it was like perfect. Yeah, good for there you, man. You go. yeah. Good deal. So, there you go. I got my checked in a bit. I need to do that. And uh, my blood pressure is fine and stuff, you know? So, yeah, Trevor mm. is yeah. what we're saying mm. here. Okay, so uh, there is one more piece of fan art. So, uh, <laughs> hold on. Hang on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Taffy, caffeine, beer, and, and, <laughs> and tar fog. Okay. Uh, Hold on and hang on. Sends me cookies. She's knit me hats before, but she sent this that you guys would like. Um, okay, so the front says WKUK, and then on the bottom it says LT, right? I think you know where this is going. And then it says PD right there, <laughs> so for little Timmy Pig Dick, right? Right. And then do you yes. guys know what this is? A butthole. Basketball. Basketball? It's my seven-spoke butthole. Oh! oh me a bit. I guessed. I opened this. Yeah, Darren nailed it. I opened this box on uh, Zucchini Boys because I, I, when I was doing Zucchini Boys, I'm like, you know what? I love Joe Bob, and Joe Bob would always do viewer mail. And I said somebody sent me mail today, so I opened it and and. So you you're giving out your actual address? No, I have a PO box. Oh. So that's why you get a PO box, and people can like send you crazy shit when they want to, you know. Got so it. anyway, so I got confused by this. You ever worry that a murderer would like hang out at your PO box and wait <laughs> for you all week? <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, I only go there a couple times a week, so he might be there for a few days. You know? Now I think Timmy yeah. might die first. <laughs> he's throwing up, he's again, doxing okay. himself. Again, again, once again, Trevor tipping the scale in his favor, <laughs> as usual. Fucking like, oh, you know what? You think I'm going to die first? Here, I'll tell people where you live and give no, them No, Timmy, I would Here, never do that. I, I don't want anyone to murder oh, Timmy. Oh, you know what? That, Speaking uh, of yeah. fan art, and hold on, let me get one more thing. Here's what I'll say though is like Timmy lives in Watertown, South Dakota. If you want to find Timmy, you can just hang out in South Dakota and figure it out. Well, actually, like, you know what? Yeah. There, there was like, a you know bit what of Timmy a... is. They're like the guy who was on a show. The the you mean the guy in the big house? Like you know, kind of like <laughs> which I'm not. Yeah, but no. Well, that's <laughs> you know when I when I had a uh, in the past when I've had what'd you say, Sam? I'd say they point to an apartment. They're like the guy yeah. in a, in the big house, and they point <laughs> the to an apartment. <laughs> You're talking about Timmy? What the one with the roof? Well, did I ever tell you guys? Like, so years ago, you know, I'm in a duplex. I'm on the bottom floor. Years ago, there was a guy that lived up above me who um, had lived in uh, the same neighborhood in Queens that you three lived in at Darren's Flop House at the same time, and it was so weird. He like lived three blocks down from you. And also at the time he was working for the Sopranos. He was driving truck, like set truck and stuff for the Sopranos. And also he was a big muscly dude. So he ended up being an extra on Sopranos a little bit. But so I would joke when he lived there, I'm like, I would call our house the Hollywood district, you know, like, or entertainment district. Cause like the two guys that have been on TV lived in the same building. But so one more fan art you know, talking about PO box and knives. So uh, I've talked about this on Zucchini boys, but one of our fans makes knives for a company and he made me 
this fucking thing mm -hmm. and he sent me it took him like a few months to make it he made the blade he made the handle yeah and Damn. it's like sharp as shit so and, he, and he knows your p.o box right now. Huh? <laughs> yeah, the, and he knows your PO box. The guy, and he the, knows guy, the, PO box. the guy who he, makes weapons. A guy who like, makes weapons. But yeah. but now, but I'm nice to him, right? So like now, like he can like send me stuff to defend myself against other PO box people that you send. You know. You don't think Selena mm. was nice to that uh, fan club lady who uh, yeah. shot her in the <laughs> See, face? I'm not or gonna. Whatever the fuck I don't happened. tell people like where my hotel is and stuff. You know. Except that one, well, there was that one though. But you know, uh, hey, just Timmy, will you put in a good word for me for one of those knives? I, I want one. You need a cooking show, baby. I've invited you. You can always yeah. come on. Well, I've been on your cooking also, show. Also, yes, you have. You know what, Darren? Here's the secret. Is we should I have, have, hey, I have a cooking Timmy, show in my go, knives. We should have a cooking contest you could. on our show. Yeah. But, like uh, whoever can cook something the fastest. The I'm, fastest? Mm hmm. I'm jealous, See, my Timmy. Problem is, I, a talk while I cook on Zucchini Boy, so it takes. But I did make five things in less than two hours the other day. So. I'm I'm jealous. I missed that because uh, I love cooking eggs different ways, and yeah. I, I'd love to show you my techniques. Ooh, I'd love to see. Your like, I cook some mean eggs. Dude, breakfast for dinner was a good idea. It was the next time you want to do breakfast for dinner, I'll join you. I'll throw I'll I throw will. down some egg dishes and uh, uh, show you. I'll just see. I'll even show you my my just my 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 scrambled egg approach, which is I got good scrambled have, egg approach. I have one too. You know, there's a guy named Mister Breakfast, and he has a website and he's a fucking genius and he has a great scrambled egg recipe. I one time tweeted about. It. I said Mister Breakfast is the best site on the internet. And then Jim Biederman's old assistant, Liz, commented on that. And she said, I know those guys. And so then Mrs. Breakfast commented and was like, I should get Mr. Breakfast in touch with you. And this was years ago. But now I have this cooking show. So I was like, I should get Mr. Breakfast on. He's like, he knows all about breakfast. That's in his name. Oh, huh, yeah. Watch a sketch. What? Yeah. Let's watch watch a sketch. Wait, you don't like our breakfast Trevor, talk? Trevor's bored in tears. You don't like our <laughs> egg talk? Uh, I'm I'm like, if we're, if we're not catering to Trevor's tantrums, then I guess the show's not. Hey, how, no, I know how you cook your eggs. You go, uh, excuse me, can I have a scrambled egg and a side of toast? <laughs> yeah, I'm not a cooker. I'm, you know what? No, I'm I team used to Trevor here. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, we're getting I used to mad. Fun of Trevor for not cooking, but he made some really good bread when I stayed with you in 2012. You were making bread. I was having a little bit of an existential crisis, and I was like, what if I just fucking cooked? And yeah, but I, your like, bread was. Learned I learned how to make bread, and yeah. then I, I fucking snapped out of it, though. Did You don't do it anymore? Is there anything you cook anymore? No. Oh, no. yeah. That was silly. That was like a bad spell when you yeah, were in that bread-making bread time. I, I thought the bread was good, though, wasn't it? No. Yeah, it was fine, but it, it didn't it didn't uh, fi fill the hole in my heart, I'll tell you that. I'd be, uh, like, you know, kneading yeast, putting it in the oven. The other, I'd have a revolver right, like, on the roof of my fucking mouth. That's what I was doing. You'd be like, what the right fuck right am now. I doing? This is... Yeah. Needing the yeast. <laughs> yeah, I know. See, that's how much of a cooker I'm not. <laughs> yeah, let's watch. Uh, what do we got? We got uh, Huggins I'd, family's always fun. Homeschool. I would be like, I'm gonna set this thing, set this thing to 350 degrees, and I'd be like, just do it, just fucking do it, you pussy, just fucking do it. Like that's that was how I that was my cooking. <laughs> All right, I say we do homeschool or fucking going to the pussy. I like that. Homeschool or are we going to the moon? I don't know. Oh, I didn't even write that. You're one down. depressed and you're cooking with an oven. I mean, the, it's right there, you know. Yeah. Who is it? <laughs> Sylvia Plath, you know. Crawl, yeah. crawl in. There's your Did exit. Yeah. What are you bringing up, Sam? Uh, I'm bringing it up right now. Okay. I will remember. You. When's your next zucchini, boys? Thursday. Jimmy? Do you or think if I do this RPG your thing. zucchini boys with you uh, Thursday, uh, that guy will send me a knife too? <laughs> I don't know. You'd have to talk to him. Oh, really quick, this guys. This Thursday I want to do uh, fancy food. If, if you're ever looking oh, yeah. for something to do mm -hmm. on YouTube, two things, mm -hmm. two things. Mm -hmm. One, uh, there's videos where people make knives and swords out of like old chains and things like that. Whoa. So great. So great. Uh, and also, there are these videos that are just, it's just a guy restoring old PlayStations and stuff like that. And he doesn't talk. And it's just a shot of the, the him cleaning off these old PlayStations. Ugh. 
It's amazing. That sounds kind of uh, soothing. It's like half hour. It's very soothing. It is very soothing. I like that. So what are we watching? That's a good one. Homeschool. Oh. All right. Okay, Caleb. Well, good morning and welcome to your first day of homeschool. Now, our first class of the day will be geometry. I was looking at our lesson plan last night, and it looks to me like... Mom, I'm going to get some Captain Crunch. Uh, excuse me, Caleb. No, you're not. There's no eating in the classroom. This is the kitchen. Well, during school hours, we're calling this the classroom. And I would appreciate it if you did not call me Mom, but instead refer to me as Mrs. Carlisle. Ms. Carlisle? Thank you, Caleb. Yes? You're not a real teacher. During school hours, I am your homeschool teacher. Okay, Mom. I hope I do really, really good at homeschool so that way I can get into a home college and then I can get a home job and make tons of home money. Caleb, I will be making sure that you are more than prepared to get into a good college. What's the square root of 144? Excuse me? What's the square root of 144? Keep it up! Keep it up, young man, because that's not in the lesson today. I don't need to know that today. So, I'm supposed to learn geometry from a lady who never graduated college. Caleb, I dropped out of school so I could raise you! Okay, so I'm supposed to learn geometry from a lady who never graduated college and wasn't smart enough to use condoms. That! You! That is detention! Sweet, where's that? Like, my room? Yeah! No! That is... That is in the laundry room! Okay, go in the laundry room. See ya. During school hours, it's a detention hall! Thanks for clearing that up, Professor. That's 20 more minutes in the detention hall! Uh-huh. Excuse me, I've got to do your... <gasps> Caleb, are you smoking? Yep. Where do I gotta go now? This is the principal's office in my room, because I'm really just trying to make it back up there. You are on strike two, young man! One more and you get suspended! If I get suspended, does that mean I go back to real school? This is real school! Now back to the kitchen! Mm be the classroom. That's right, classroom! Okay, now there are three types of triangles. There's the isosceles. Ms. Carlisle? Yes, Caleb? I just got an invisible telegram from the elf kingdom. Princess Buttercup is in trouble and they need me to go help, so I'm gonna have to skip today. Caleb, Jesse, Carlisle? What? You're pretending, I'm pretending. We're pretending together. That is, that's it. You go down to the garage. <gasps> oh no, the garage? Is that like super detention? Yes, that's like super detention. It's the super detention hall. The super detention hall? Is that the one with the pool table? Yes! No! <gasps> you don't go to the garage! You go outside to the backyard! That's where the real pool is! <laughs> I'll go get my swim trunk. No! Caleb! You! You go! <sighs> to your room. There we go. Good first day, Mom. It's Mrs. Carlisle. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day, lady. everyone. Homeschool. <laughs> Poor Miss Carlisle. That is a good Mother's Day skit. Happy Mother's Day. Remember to call stick. your mom tomorrow. That's homeschool. right. Homeschool, yes. I, uh, I, I, I like Timmy's performance in that one. I think that's a really good one. Thank you. It's fun. That, you know, uh, Amazing. my mom is not like that, but the physicality, that's my mom. Like, People were saying mm. that the, that Timmy is a milf in that sketch. So mm. yeah, everybody is, wants would to. Would you fuck consider my mom? your mom a milf? M me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I mean, no. I no. I can't do that. You wouldn't do, do your mom. No. <laughs> would you do your if, mom? If she was stuck in a dryer. <laughs> how does that? How does that change? I mean, okay, no, but also, why would that change the? Situation? Hold on, Timmy, I'm not. I'm not explaining it right. So the front part of her is stuck in a dryer. Yeah, yeah. All right. So Timmy, your mom is. She sees an earring in the dryer, and she's reaching in there, and her hair gets stuck, and she's like, "Oh, I'm, I'm st stuck," and her milfy ass is hanging out, and it's just. <laughs> And it's just there. It's just ripe for oh the taking. God. And you've been thinking about it, you know? <laughs> I mean, the uh, answer's still no, but I love this scenario. This is let, me, let, me, let me sweeten the pot a little bit, Timmy. Uh, <laughs> you're, uh, my dad's dick up. in here. Isn't this yeah, a honey it, pot? Isn't that what? Like, <laughs> I don't know. It's, it's, it's your mom, but in this scenario, she's a stepmom. Like, it's your dad's second wife. But yeah, you're not. I don't know. I don't want you to. You married her when you were when you were two. 
What? Oh, her, right. He so married, she's been like he a real mom. Her. Yeah. <laughs> she's been like a real mom. But though. she's not related. Yeah. You know what? I have no fear that you guys are all going to do as great a job at erotica as I did. Right. You wrote a... Because uh, uh, <laughs> this is all... Erotica. So who's, who's is this week on the Patreon? Sam. That's me. Nice. I'm up. Nice. Sam's will be up on, I think, Tuesday we're talking. So, yeah. yeah. Uh, this is a good. Uh, this is a. This is a good. Uh, um, segue. Uh, no comment. Sparky Sin says, "You guys are the best." I miss Zach so much. <laughs> <laughs> Us too, pal. Us too. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> um, oh, it's funny because I. It made me think of the the getting stuck. Uh, that made me think of our the Santa Claus sketch. <laughs> oh yeah. Hope nobody's <laughs> Don't get anything naughty. Oh, yeah. Which is also funny because thinking about that has given me an erection. <laughs> right Wait, now, you have an erection. Wow. No, no. Thinking wow. about the mom getting stuck thing. Yeah. Oh, I thought you. Oh, I thought yeah, you meant the yeah, Santa yeah. Claus sketch, which the premise was that was that Santa Claus was trying to like uh, hook up with kids. So that that was <laughs> that was getting caused, that was, possibly. Yeah. That was the what? That was like what? Some uh, issues. Um, the uh, so the homeschool. I, I grew up in a very religious setting. Right. So a lot of the, the kids that I knew at church were homeschooled. Always seemed weird. You know, something off. Yeah. Something off. And it, I remember it being like a bizarre thing because you'd be talking to them. And, and I, like the idea of homeschool, like, so you just, you just you just never leave your house? Like, that's like, and they're like, oh, no, we like have meetups with other homeschooled, you know, things. But it's like <laughs> your parents are the teachers. And then you'd be like, but your parents are... I mean, no offense, your parents are kind of losers. Like, you know, like, why, why are you, <laughs> like, you're going to, like, take life advice from, but I, I, I don't know. I, I, I find the whole homeschool thing bizarre. So, yeah. so Trevor, let me get, get this straight. You think that there's something wrong with people who are different from you? Oh, yes, absolutely. <laughs> no, Any, okay. The slightest, slightest difference. Anything <laughs> Anything that I am not, I, I, I'm judgmental about, and I, I look at you with suspicion. I feel like this has been a really good stream for Trevor. I feel like we've dug up a bunch of stuff, you know? I think it's good. good. Uh, he, needs it. um, he does. He needs our, he needs um, our help. That's a fun one. <laughs> well, it's midnight. I got to hop. Darren, get it's the It's midnight. Fuck Happy out Mother's Day. I'm sorry. Yeah, happy Mother's Day. Oh, yeah. I hope you all, you know, call your moms at 6 a.m. Oh, I will. Yeah. And to those who don't have moms, still happy Mother's Day. That's right. Happy Mother's Day. Shout out yep. to people I know who it can have be tough. children. They always have a tough Mother's Day, you know. Well, that's a down. That's a downer. No, but yeah. it's that's the I, end of the show. Something you like to say to people. Yeah. Don't call uh, people stress. I mean. <laughs> Yeah. Tomorrow you should night find on, a mom on, on Twitch. And tomorrow greater. night on Trailer Boys, we're doing Bad Moms as the theme, and we have oh, a special, yeah. a special guest, Kathy Brown. Dude, I was gonna oh. drop in. Is there room for me and Kathy on the same show? Sure. The more, the merrier. I know she'd love to see me. I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to be cocky. I just know she'd love to see me. That'll okay, make it that Jimmy, much more of a present Jimmy, for her. Sam's mom is stuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, okay. dude! Does Sam find out? Mm, no. No, no, no. Okay. That's the thing that you can't ever think of what happens after. You don't get to say what happens you know? next. Because what happens if you think about what happens after you do it? Like you know, the, con the consequences. Are I don't horrific. know, man. Because I mean, I don't want to fuck anybody's mom. I, I really don't. Like, I don't want to fuck any of your guys' moms. Like. Like especially Sam's mom's kind of my, my one of my moms. You know? Timmy, it's the mom thing that makes you against this rape. <laughs> <laughs> That's what's oh, getting that in the, the way trick? here. <laughs> is that the trick? Is that the whole trick you're trying to sit, tell? Is that the whole trick you're trying to get me to say I'd rape a mom? Is that what you guys wanted to do? I mean, it was odd that that was the that uh, was your hang up. Happy yeah, Mother's Day, everybody. <laughs> we'll see you next week. I was so busy. Uh, I was so busy we just like to trying mom. to get past this dead weight fucking oh. yet another let's make Timmy uncomfortable question thing oh. that I didn't even realize that it was a rape thing. So obviously the no to all of it. So yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sam, play us out. Uh, I gotta find a play mom. Us out. Someone tell me a mom. 
Hey Trevor, yeah, go ahead and street. raid. Hey Trevor, raid somebody for us, will you, buddy? Uh, I'm gonna right. search mom. Good night, everybody. On Twitch. Hi, Chad. Love you, buddy. Mom, Bye. she's not live. Check out all the uh, shows on the Whitest Kids Empire this week. Timmy's <laughs> doing Zucchini Boys. Sam's doing Trailer Boys tomorrow. The flagship, as always, is on Friday, and uh, you know we'll we'll see you here next Saturday. Also, check out the Patreon. We're yes. doing a Bucker Cinemeyer season two, The Trouble in Whore Town, only available on Patreon. At first, and then it will hit YouTube. <laughs> we gotta stop letting his mic be live, Sam. We gotta just cut it. Uh, all right, I'll just cut it off. <laughs> as soon as it seems like Trevor's gonna make an announcement, we gotta just mute him. <laughs> hey, are there any moms in chat? There's gotta be some, right? Yeah, there's gotta be old, some. So our fans are old. <laughs> yeah. Uh, if there's a mom in chat, you you get to pick who we raid. Oh. Uh. Train oh, oh, bike forty nine right, right says, there. "Hey, it's me, Timmy's mom." What? Wait. Prefix suffix six six six. You're a new mom. Yeah. You get to pick. Congratulations. Yeah. You get to pick. I'm, I'm waiting for for your answer. I'm I'm all for it. In the biz, this is what we call dead air. But on here, we just call it streaming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is just our channel. This is just. <laughs> oh yeah, slow mo. We got. I'm gonna turn slow mode off. So we, we got we got two minutes to wait for whatever this is. <laughs> yeah. Wait, uh... This is fantastic. Is anyone watching while I? Let's just uh... leave it at that. Is anyone watching? <laughs> <laughs> so just watch watch chat to make sure while, I, while I'm turning okay. this off. Oh, you're talking to us. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to stick just, around because I want to see this. Uh, we're just grab ass around here. How a sociaf beha behave says CYR. Well, who are we looking for? Who's the one that said? Uh, prefix suffix 666. All right. Turn the slow mode off. Let's look for that. Prefix suffix 666. Prefix suffix six six six, some sort of Satanist, and a new mom, a new mom and a Satanist. I saw a movie about that once. <laughs> new mom Satanist. Yeah, had that that woman who. Uh, thanks guys, but wait, wait, choose choose a channel. You get to pick a channel. What, did she just say thanks guys? Yeah, she just said thanks guys. Come on, prefix. You Excuse can do me, this. I'm sorry. We believe in you. Give us a channel. Sam, what was the movie? The Satan movie. Uh, it was with that with that that woman who just hates the heck out of Woody Allen. Doctor Foxme. Okay. Uh, uh, Rosemary's Baby. Oh sure 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 sure. <laughs> she hates watched, the heck uh, out of Woody Allen. I watched Maniac she does. Cop. I watched Maniac Cop Two yesterday. Ooh. One a great series it really is because it's all about like cops are bad and in maniac cop 2 like even the serial killers is like these cops are fucking crazy <laughs> uh i just do dr fox meat because we're yeah, yeah. yeah she said no no she said dr fox meat oh, okay yeah. that's what there i'm doing go. sam's on it we got it all right all right everybody love you Have guys love you too Bye. love you guys good show Maybe. wait are you talking to me or are you talking to chat I'm talking to chat and you and whoever else. Do right. we need to talk about anything? We good? No, no. No, I'm saying with the love you. Oh, I'm saying love you to all you guys. Love you, Sam. Love I'll you, I'll probably, uh, I'll drop in tomorrow. Yeah. It'll be after... I mean